Wait, why, why is... Why is chat saying, like... I'm, I'm, I, I said I'm gonna make it your problem and that stuff, but you're saying I'm gonna play Destiny? What? Wait, what do you, what do you mean? What is that? What do you, what do you mean? What, what? That's not, that's not happening. <laughs> I, I signed the contract? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> what the fuck are you saying? What is chat? What is wrong with you? What the hell? No, I'm, I'm, today is not, a, a, we know, today we are being blinded by the light. Cla like, ca wrong one. Uh, we are being blinded by the light. That's all it is. That's all it is. It's simple. It's, it's incredibly easy to understand, chat. You guys are just making it worse in, in, in any and all possible ways. God damn you. As an Austin, New Dawn, and Captain Windfall all gave subs. You know, I, and I got... I'm, I'm, I'm here to eat... Why did I buy these? I Listen, okay. My streams may not be the most entertaining thing in the entire world, but what they are at least have a point. And today's point is that I'm going to be standing here. I'm going to be sitting here looking at all of you and discussing the merits of this food I just bought, which is... 365 Whole Foods Market, 10 gram protein per serving, chewy protein bites, vanilla cashew, and almond naturally flavored. That's it. That's all. That's all that's happened. Uh, that, that's, you know what? They look like balls. They're balls. They're just, just they're small whole food balls, which... I know. I know. It is riveting. It is riveting. You, you seem to think that I can't have an entertaining stream without eating balls. But let me tell you, I can. I just choose to eat them anyway. Mm-hmm. 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 It's a don't don't exit to doubt me slip. How dare you? You know what I've been through. Mm hmm. I don't trust the words all natural cars and tanks are all naturally made with stuff found in the ground. Look what they've done. All things are made with stuff you found in the ground. The entire the, the, the entire infrastructure of the planet is made with stuff you found in the ground. That is the society that we live in. I think your alerts are off. Oh, shit, they are. Fixed. Like, it's true. What do you mean, huh? If, if you want... Like every tool that makes something else has to come from the earth somehow. Every every society is that way. Why am I being my institute for this? Nice this is ridiculous. Is this how you respect me? Is this, is this how is this how you respect me, chat? That I I come back. After a, like a week long trip, I'm finally home, and and the first thing you do is to is to berate me. You know, you said you'd be back on Tuesday. Well, I did say that. You're right. I wanted to stream yesterday, but I didn't. Um, I don't remember why I did. Oh, finally, thank you, real people that are that are important today. Star Practium, Prachinum. I don't know how to say your name. Thanks for the five gifted subs. The first ever five gifted subs you've ever given. This very kind of you. Thank you very much for the support. Someone cares today. Someone cares. Mm-hmm. Wow. This is wild for me, chap. I, ex I expected better. I expected to come back with a warm meal and happiness. I didn't get that.
All I wanted to do was sit here and eat my vanilla cashew bites. I'm out of vanilla cashew bites. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. Do we have a, a 7TV emote for cum? Ew. That's the doom cum. Huh. That's wild. Why? Why do we do that? Nice Damn, look at it go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat you, chap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking eat you. I'm gonna, who, who's the... <laughs> Dej. Dej is great. Dej is a great emote. Dej is a great emote, but not, not just... So, I don't know. I don't know where or why Twitch has adjusted to this kind of meta. Um, but it seems that like most of the, you know, good streams have just a slew of seven TV emotes to go along with, with their, their streams. And there's some really good ones. There's some really good ones. Uh, I particularly enjoy, um, uh, caught. I think caught is, is pretty good. Um, not really sure why, but it's, uh, that, that's a good one. That's a good one. That, that one gets a lot of mileage. That one gets a lot of mileage. Um, I, I like, uh, what's the one with, with, with Pepe is sleeping and he, um, like his eyes are wide awake though. He's like, I don't, I don't remember how that one goes. Um, is it Wokage? It's Wokage. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. That one's pretty good. Big fan of that one. Um, uh, let's go is pretty good too. I like that one. Uh, I mean, huh. Gets a lot of, a lot of use. I won't lie. Oh, it's a lot of use. Hey, Brick, I wanted to meet you at PAX East. However, couldn't get the days off, so maybe next time. I don't know. It's the milk. You frightened me. I, don't, I, I would maybe have to be, be a little bit more worried about uh, that kind of establishment. You got to look up Goku Gritty. Oh, no. We got Goku Gritty. We absolutely have Goku Gritty, right? We have Goku Gritty, don't we? Yeah, yeah. We got Goku Gritty. We got Goku, Goku hitting the Gritty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, that's one that we couldn't. I couldn't miss. Um, where's the plant cam? I was waiting to see how long that would take. I was I was genuinely waiting. You think I didn't you think I didn't prepare for all of you? You genuinely think that I was not ready for you asking for plant cam? It was there. It was always ready. It was always ready. You just didn't believe. Alright. Just just bang into existence. Plant cam had, had would never left technically. It stuck around the whole time. Welcome back from Boston. Did you find your wooden leg? I don't know what that means. Um, but no. No, Boston. Pax is Pax is great, chat. I love Pax East still. It's still a lovely time. Um, I had had a good time. I spent some time with some friends. Oh, oh, right. It's from the song. You're right. I had some I had a good time. I spent some time with some friends, met some folks, met, you know. Did a huge fan meetup. Way too many of you were there. Um, kind of insane how many of you were there. Did not expect that. Um, that was great. That was a really fun time. Uh, the weather was less great. The weather was not my favorite. It was about like 28 degrees on a couple of those days. Little cold. 28 degrees Fahrenheit. That's like negative three Celsius. I don't know. I'm not quite 100% sure. Chap, please, please, you know. Yeah, Saturday did suck. Saturday, it rained all day Saturday. It wasn't too cold, but it had the rain, so. I don't know. It was rough, but What's bum? Um, see ya. Hi, Bricky. Do you have any plans to play the God? Oh, the probably was already going on. God of War, Ride Rock DLC. Seems something right up your alley. You know, <laughs> what's that old phrase? Um, good times make weak men. Uh, that's one of those phrases, right? Or something similar to that. Um, or some, some statement of that of that nature. Uh, and, and, I, and I must say, um, it's not entirely an un, untruthful statement. Um, weak men make strong bottoms. 
okay, that's not what I was going for. But, you know, I had to read that because it just it threw in to my brain. And it just like, I just had to read it. Um, but, uh, so, you know, like good times make weak men kind of thing. Um, things are good. You know, I, I'm feeling pretty good. I, you know, I had a long trip from Boston. It was, it was, it was long. It was tiring. I'm tired. And, you know, my face is tired. That whole deal. That's, that's all, you know, I'm sorry, all all thing. Um, but for the most part, life, you know, life is good. Um, but the life is too good because the only reason I have not played the God of War Ragnarok DLC is I don't want to set up my PS5. This whole rant, this whole tangent was entirely dedicated to the concept that I just don't want to set up my PS5. That's it. That's really it. You know what else is on the PS5 that would be kind of nice to play? The Project Wingman DLC. You haven't done it? So, okay. Okay. Sorry, chat. I'm eating mixed nuts. You never know what you're going to get. Um. So. Can I? Can we talk about something, chat? Can we talk about something? All right, listen. I was eating these mixed nuts and I was thinking about something, right? I was thinking about a concept. I think that as a as a cis white male, I have a genetic disadvantage in the fighting game community. Now, give me a moment right now. The FGC. There's no way in hell that I can have an advantage of this particular scenario situation. You go to the Guilty Gear Strive world and you see the top eight. And when you find that the top eight of the entire Guilty Gear Strive tournament are all trans. And then, and then, you, and then you go out and then you look at the top of, of Tekken players or, or you, you look at the, the Hispanic community fucking rolling in the King of Fighters. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just saying... All right, I, I'm, I'm just saying, I want to make it very clear that if there's any, any particular time in which I must feel like a minority and now must educate you on the concept of being a minority, it is when I go to a Smash tournament somewhere in SoCal. All right, there's the one time I will ever be able to educate you on this situation. All right, and after that, I will teach you the proper way to talk to a manager. But until then, I want to make it very clear. I still get fighting games, not because... I don't practice and I'm not very good. It's because the FGC community is racist. Against my fucking cottage cheese looking ass. Sorry, that was no, but 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 on, on honest, but but on, honest to God, honest to God though, the 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 fucking eight player top top or sorry top seven players Guilty Gear Strive tournament, every single one of them is trans is fucking funny as hell. Nothing wrong with it. It's great, honestly. Cool. It's so fucking funny though. Un unironic, fantastic top eight. I'm a straight Latino and I'm bad at King of Fighters. You should have been a gay Latino then. You, you had you had your answer right there. You had to spout it to me. You had to ask my opinion on that kind of concept. I already had the answer for you. You should have been a gay Latino. And you would have been a lot better at King of Fighters. Do you think, do you think my or, or Terry wants to play with you? Hmm? Being gay makes me good at fighting games. Well, clearly, you've been fighting for rights your whole life. I'm sorry. I was just... 
I, 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 I'm, I'm sorry. I got, I got, I got a couple, I got a couple zingers today. You know, I feel, I feel like I've, uh, I feel like I've, I've, I've kept in a couple plus twos over my time in Boston. You know, you know, this, 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 this stream is going, going all kinds of world. You know, I'm doing my best. You know, see, it, it's, it's all, it's all about like when you're supposed to come out. You know, because for the most part. A lot of these amazing fighting game players didn't have anything to do because it, it, you know, you couldn't really like, what is it? You couldn't really like leave, you know, you had to put adversity on dead stop. You know, you, you, you had an entire global pandemic. You can you come out to the parents, dad gets the bell or whatever. He's like, no daughter of mine. And then like, but you can't be kicked out. You're COVID. You got, you got immunity. You got diplomatic immunity. So what are you going to do? You're going to go in your room. You're going to play fucking guilty gear strive all day, every single day. Next thing you know, top eight. And it was all thanks to the deadbeat dad. Nah, that wasn't as good. Nah, minus two. <laughs> anyway, um, I got. Anyway, I'm gonna read some donations. Um, hey Twitch, I don't know ma'am, you can just play Smash as a white person. Not well. Um, just waiting for someone to make take care. Just want to see if you're interested in considering joining the- the What the fuck is wrong with me? Jesus Christ. Oh God. Um, just wanted to see if you're consider- Just wanted to see if you're considering joining the 40k narrative tournament this year. One of the other streamers apparently has 200 plus people serving as a high fleet with the intent of forcing a nid whim. I'll be running Night Lords. Uh, no, nothing for me in terms of the narrative thing. That does sound pretty hilarious. They actually are doing that, though. That is very funny. Uh, Sakabato with $10 dono said, Okay, Sajam, 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 go back to commentating. What, what's the, what's the, the, the Sajam? How the fuck do you say his name? Sajam, 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 Sajam. All right. What was his meme for a while? The Say Jam meme, channel meme. I watched a lot of his content for a while during the Guilty Gear Strive era. And I don't really remember. Um, all right, then chat room. <laughs> Is that it? So Jam Hussein? Will it kill? Will it kill? That's the one. Will it kill? I'm just waiting for someone to make in a star. like animation for Helldivers 2. And they're already getting the animations going. It just needs to take some time. Uh, it's the milk. Thanks for the 250 bucks. No brickle fleshlight. What the fuck is wrong with you? Hi, just follow. Is it okay to say you're sexy? Only if you're trans. The only the only people who can hit on me are brisket mains. You know, some five some five star Texas steakhouse fucking brisket main with a a yo yo that can you know destroy the UN. Who the fuck is the new Guilty Gear character? What's your name? AJ. New Guilty Gear character. Happy chaos. That's not right. Abba, that's a musician chat. Fucking idiots. <sighs> Leon Scamity, thanks for the 16 months. Biscuit Bandit and Nyafi, thank you as well. <laughs> no, it's a band, stupid. All right, who's Abba? What the fuck is this character? What who what what lock does that key on open? Woman? Are you sure? Hi Bricky, thank you for gold like content. I have just qualified for a closed beta test for Frostpunk 2 in Warsaw. Oh! FBA will allow me to be very vague. I would love to share some info on the games you either that you are worried about. Cheers. So, um, Sebek Alex man, um, actually, uh, since you said that, I I won't be hit with any kind of annoying um, uh, NDA probably issues. Uh, so actually, I did receive an email to go to Warsaw to try the game out, Frostpunk two and all that kind of stuff. Um, unfortunately, and, and I I hate doing this because it feels fucking shitty because I, I actually would really like to you know fucking culture myself a little bit 
um, despite spending an entire hour uh, or more like 20 minutes talking about trans characters in Guilty Gear Strive, um, which, hey, you know, trans rights, whole thing, I get. Um, I would like to go to Warsaw and do fun things like that, but they they did offer to pay for the, the, the flight and lodging, but, but there's nothing on top of that. And if I'm going to be gone for like a, another week during, I think it was like May or April or something like that, that's a whole week of no YouTube, no no streaming content. And so I, I need to, especially with the merch site kind of getting bumped up, you kind of need, I, I kind of need like a buffer there. And, and I didn't have it in the budget, unfortunately, which it sucks, but I, I hate denying cool opportunities like that to go travel and do stuff. Um, but it's, <sighs> you know, it, it is it is with the, the case. You know, it is the case in that situation. It, it sucks though, you know? It sucks that that's the case. Hotel stream, bro. I, you, you think I'm gonna get the the zero zero point zero 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 five two three six four kilobytes a second upload speed coming off the Wi-Fi from the fucking hotel room in Warsaw, Poland? You can't wait for you to watch my stream at a bit rate of nine. <laughs> um, hey Breaker, I think for today's stream it was a slow day. Also, have you heard of Millennia? Oh, it's a four X Civ type game. No, shit. Um, I thought you meant, uh, uh, I thought you meant like the, the Dark Souls Elden Ring character. Um, no, I have not heard that game before. Hey, Bricky, I have a gift for you. Up, left, down, down, down. Um, I got my tax refund. Now I'm going to start my dump enough money on streamers to start a talent agency speed run. Hey, talent agencies are cool. There's a lot of good ones out there. There's a lot of not good ones out there. But talent agencies are a big thing for a lot of us. Medium Spark, thanks for the tier one sub. I appreciate it. Also, Lord J, Oi Broggle, shid your pant respectfully. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Or ma'am. All right, done and done. Hey, we have surprisingly good internet. Not your hotels. Hotels don't have good internet. That, that, that is a that is a simple, just simp a correct statement across the across the board. <laughs> You're saying like, oh, we got good internet in, in, in Poland. Like, yeah, I'm sure you do have good internet in Poland. It is a massive video game hub. You probably don't have good internet at the, whatever the Polish version of a Days Inn is. Or, or a Best Westin. Best Warsaw. Also, Endosim. And, and what's up, Rob? Power word shit. Ah, sorry, that was, that. I'll let it happen. I did not see a warmer fan animation. I did not see that. It works. It works. It works. It's fine. It's fine, chat. Just let it, just let it be. Um, I actually, oh, actually, that's a good point. I haven't set this thing up yet. I do, I need to set this up. I was going to do it today, but we got really, really busy doing a bunch of new stuff. Got some merch things happening and stuff. So it was a little bit busy. Did I move? No, this is the same office as before. It is simply, uh, we, we, we read, we redid it. We redid it. It looks nicer now. Um, just got more, you know, things it's got carpet it's got carpet in different door and stuff yeah oh shit just hit my desk my bad made the space look more mature the space looks more mature but it also looks like more generic at the same time you know it's a combination of of stupid uh but also you know looks kind of good wait Hold on. I'm getting a very important message. Just kidding, I lied. Clink, clink, the greatest hits. What the hell is this, Twitcherman? I don't, uh, man, seeing a Twitcherman tweet is terrifying. Hey, Bricky. Was great meeting you at PAX. I'm um, ready for my high polite drifter stream now. Can pass that one? Oh, sick. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure. Wait, I'm ready for my hyper light drifter stream. Oh, you were the hyper light drifter for it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay, that's true. That's true. Um, hyper light drifter is in the cards. You know what I was like? Okay, so today's... Pro okay, all right. We don't have exclamation point docket, but it would be kind of handy. Um, you know what today is uh, is going on? Also, verify check mark in chat. Cabal, state your business immediately. I like 40k. 
pass. Anyway, um, <laughs> hi, nice to meet you. <laughs> um, you know, so um, to today, so today's probably going to be a more chill day. I wanted to do one of those streams where we play a video game that specifically is really good with the, to talk with chat. There are a couple of games like that. Power Wash Simulator is one of them. You know, uh, I actually wanted to play COD Zombies today uh because uh the the <clears throat> boy uh client is back up and so because of that we can do it without having any fear of getting fucking ratted and stuff um so i kind of want to play just some cod zombies on stream and have a have a badass time um because that's a game that you can like you know you can take it as seriously as you want to take it and i could just like chat ask for chat chat and chat with chat and chat you know you know you know what i mean chat um so that'd be good stuff uh, and then, but later on, I, so I don't know what my next video is going to be on. Actually, can I, I'm going to rant about something real quick. All right. I'm going to rant about something. You know, what fucking, it just, it, it makes me so sad. Alan Wake 2. Huge video. Huge video. Long, long amounts of content, all kinds of stuff. You know, hour and five minutes. All that jazz. 265,000 views. Not sad about that good views good views don't get me wrong good stuff <clears throat> star wars battlefront is shit and i hate it Three hundred thousand views two days nice guy. you wonder why people spend all their time making youtube content bitching about every single thing possible that's why that's why let me spend 20 minutes talking about one of my favorite indie games as in the last like five years, Robo Quest and why it's so amazing, 166K. It's just, it's demoralizing, man. It's demoralizing. All the angry videos do so well. <sighs> it's hard to stay so positive. In the voice of Pontius Pilate from Life of Brian, do you find it? Oh, okay, you know what? When I say the name, Fairness? Biggest apostrophe dot, dot, dot. Helldiver's video, very, doing very, very, very well. That being said, uh, I mean, that kind of, that's kind of expected, you know, like, like Hell, Hell Divers is in right now. Like, that game is in. So, I mean, that's an algorithm, I mean, probably like an algorithmic type thing. Um, though I won't lie, I was proud of the Hell Divers video. I think uh, when it came to writing, when it came to like actually writing the script, I think Hell Divers was the best written script of all those videos. So there is that. How'd my COD video do? Oh, the one of me complaining about the campaign. 658,000 views. Yeah, it's about right. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Justified, I agree, but yeah. Hey man, every single Warhammer 40K faction explained. 8.7 million. Can, can, can we... <sighs> Can we talk about that for a bit? Can we discuss the simple fact that that Warhammer as a concept was not something I ever attempted to make my thing. It was never one of those things. That felt that fell directly into my lap and I did not ask it to. So quick question, Prout. It just and also I see the knights in the cabinet. You got down. You see? <laughs> it just it just did. I just made a video like, okay, let me, okay. You, you want, you want honesty? You, you want some, you want some hard honesty chat? You want, you want to get hard with me? You want to be hard with me? Let's be hard together. Okay. Let's get, let's get off together. So whenever I, whenever there's, I, I learned this in the League of Legends era. Okay. That if you want to just milk a lot of fucking views, you do a something explained, a, a nutshell thing or some kind of tier list. It, it does great. It's always good because YouTube rewards long watch time and people want to watch all top tens or whatever it is, right? It's just the way it is. Top five total dick champions. Remember that banger from before I could even fucking drink or every League of Legends champion in a nutshell. Probably still my like 4 million views, probably like my fifth highest viewed video of all time. All kinds of stuff like that. 
at some point I just was like you know what I like Warhammer this is not too you know well not too difficult it took me forever to edit that video but I'll do an every faction explain could be kind of enjoyable you know and it's going to get lots of good it'll, it'll get more than usual good views because of that whole thing you don't fucking expect it to get almost 9 million you don't it's not in the cards and then and then right after that quiet shy is ring 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 banana phone it's like hey bricky uh you, your warhammer video is doing great uh did you want to do this like podcast idea because dk doesn't know anything about warhammer and you know he's been on like painting streams and stuff you want to do this cool idea where it's like warhammer guy tells non-warhammer guy things about warhammer and i'm like that's kind of a kind of a neat idea shy that sounds like a pretty cool idea. Yeah, why not? We'll give it a shot. It seems like a pretty low uh, requirement on my end. Once every two weeks, give or take. And, <laughs> and now here, now there's Adric, and Adric is huge too. No, oh, huge. You know, it's if two hundred thirty thousand subs or whatever on YouTube is. I don't know where huge is at this point, but it's it's sizable for this kind of community, right? It's sizable. Um, and then. Yeah, yeah, Adric was bi-weekly for the first, like, three months, and then we changed that. Um, and, uh, no, it's... And, and, and now here I am. And now I'm Warhammer guy. And now I'm Warhammer guy. And, and you know, and you know, I will take this over the league guy. Any day of the week, I will take this over the league guy. Because here's the fucking difference. Here's the fucking difference between being the League of Legends content creator and the Warhammer content creator. League of Legends players don't play games that aren't League of Legends. It's the only thing they understand. It's the only thing they try to do anything of. Warhammer is a niche hobby you add on top of your already existing enjoyable things. Warhammer players play lots of video games sometimes or things like that and then they do all of the uh warhammer stuff on top of it when they don't want to play video games so when you want to play a bunch of hell divers you're gonna do well and you're gonna get good hell diver like views because it's warhammer pilled and people who play a lot of warhammer play a lot of hell divers normally so at least at least there is still some kind of spread when it comes to all that kind of stuff if i'm gonna be known for anything this is fine I am okay with this. Now, is it a little bit annoying when every single goddamn stream someone asks me about what I think about niche specific Warhammer lore that even I don't know about? A little, a little bit. Is it a little bit annoying when I'm trying to do a video on some totally other topic and someone's like, this reminds me of the time that Katie had turned to dust. A little bit, a little bit. But it's a whole of uh, it's a whole hell of a lot better than wow, Bricky. Alan Wake is a lot like my NASA's top lane. Drown yourself. Ugh. Anyway, um, uh, great, great starts here. Uh, Llama, thanks for gifting a sub to... It, it is Cabal, right? KBA, or is it Cab Hall? I'm assuming it's Cabal. Thank you. Um, in the Pontius Pilot of Life of Brian, do you find it visible when I say the name Biggest Brickus? I have no idea what the fucking hell the voice of Pontius Polite from Life of Brian is. Honestly, as far as I'm concerned, you just spoke hieroglyphics to me, which is very impressive because those are only written. Um, also, Rika, hey, gamer, you helped me get into Warhammer. So quick question, Croot. And also, I see the knights in the cabinet, you goddamn farmer. That's good. That's good. It's a Monty Python movie. Oh, I haven't, I haven't read. I haven't watched that one. I've only seen the Holy Grail. That's good. You goddamn farmer. You goddamn farmer. That's good because knights were agricultural at some, at, in the beginning. So, uh, yeah, so, you know, we have my pile of shame here and all that jazz. So, we got Questorus, Hive Tyrant, hey, hey, hey. Questorus, Questorus.
We also made sure to get a uh, oof talk because brutal cunning is an amazing, amazing time. I gotta read the big DACA. Oh, ow! I'm shocking myself because of the fucking pad mat thing on the bottom. God, I'm gonna have hemorrhoids. Um, or a hernia. I'm gonna have a hernia. I have a hernia. Not hemorrhoids. Um, good to meet you, dude. While I couldn't drive my partner to the meet and greet, they were wearing the Bridget jacket that day. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh, the fucking, um, the, I, yeah, you had the brisket jacket. I, I'm so sorry that you're so bad at playing Guilty Gear, though, because you're clearly not trans. Um, because I met you and you weren't, uh, which sucks. But, um, Bridget jacket was pretty cool. Um, I'm, dude, I'm so on this. I'm so on the, 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 the trans Guilty Gear Strive player pill thing. It's so funny to me. It's like, it's genuinely hilarious while simultaneously just being like cool, you know? It's just awesome, you know? It's, it's, it's just it's just cool to see. It's like, wow, it's, it's really great to see such like a big like trans community in a game on that kind of thing. But it's also just so fucking funny that they're all the best players. The top eight is all trans Guilty Gear players. It's just so funny to me. Ugh. Yo, Bricky, blah, 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 blah. Guilty Gear Strive rocks. <laughs> it does, though. It's a fun game. I'm not very good at it. It's a little too combo heavy for me. Not kind of usual, but it is not bad. You know, it's a cool ass tattoo, Mr. Brick. Did you hide the Among Us in there or do you think better? That's right. We were considering doing that, weren't we? Oh, shit. <laughs> I did not. That's right. We were considering hiding the Among Us. Um, we were considering hiding the Among Us in the, the, the tattoo on the back of my leg. It's a space tattoo of him like flying. All right. You know what? Where's my... It's not charged. Fuck. Oh, I got, I got nothing else to do. Oh, well, I guess we're going to stay on plant, plant cam. There's still time. I mean, it's not done. So you are right. There is still time. We can't. We can. We can make it worse. Thank you for making me finally play Mass Effect. So 40 Ks with some doctors versus the void right now. Fuck you. I hate you. Yo, fade and perfect. Thanks for the prime sub. Uh, let's see. Yeah, uh, Mass Effect 1 is pretty rough at times. Ma Mass Effect is one of those games that everyone holds in really high regard, but nobody ever really calls perfect. Mass Effect are, are fantastic titles, but they've, they're have they rough. At, they're rough in a lot of ways. The, the fact that it's so beloved is in, um, is in like spite of it. ME1 is really jank. Yeah, even the remastered version, it's still jank. It's better. But it's still, it's still very rough. For the most part, I remember playing Mass Effect 1 and 100% uh, it in the exact playthrough I wanted and then playing 2 and 3 over and over again with that singular playthrough because I just did not want to do much Mass Effect 1. Though Mass Effect 1 does have the best villain. Saren. Best villain by far. I realized listening to Avrik today that your coffee planet would be just would just be the gamer subs planet. Well, yeah, I got ideas, you know, I got ideas. When I ask uh, how many people at PAX told you that they got into Warhammer from your videos? Oh, dude, like two thirds. You know, I, w I won't lie. A good portion of the, the viewers there at the at the meetup at PAX. Um, there was a lot of like, so you want to main old school folks. Yeah. Um, but it was like, like a good half. Yeah. Like a good half of them were war, were like, you got my, I got my Warhammer videos into you. So it, it was a lot. Also, hey, Scissor, thanks for the tier one sub. Appreciate it. You feel like GW owes you money? GW doesn't owe me shit. Just so, GW, so long as GW doesn't come after me for my legally distinct and delicious merchandise. I'm all good. 
I'm all good. Dire say thanks to Scissor. Scissor, who's with a tier one sub. Appreciate that too. <laughs> the say when the main vids were really fun. Oh, you, oh goodness, how long have you been here? Oh God. Oh dear God. So you want to main is is fun in in retrospect. And nowadays, I, I you know it, it's like any any creative outlet. You look at your old stuff and you hate it. You know, I, I can't undo that. It's just a mental thing. For honor, raw. What the fuck is a good community? Damn, we got a lot of people from PAX coming into the stream. What's up, guys? How you doing? Goddamn. Hey, I mean, I, I, I apologize. Listen, if you got into Warhammer 40k, you may have lost a lot of money, but at least you mostly kept your sanity. If you got into my in, into League of Legends for my videos, I am purely sorry. I am only sad. Like, I am only sorry for what I have done. It is just how it be. Uh, hey, Germ Graves, thanks for becoming a YouTube member, too. And what's up, uh, Course It's Siren? How you doing? Uh, here for the big five. Oh, how is that 9% of your gaming catalog is four-player co-op shooters? I don't know. Any plans on dealing with the NW3 zombies mode? No, the new Modern Warfare 3 zombies mode looks like actual hot dog shit, so I'm not going to play that. Um, that being said, I would, you know what? I would go back to MW3 2011 and I would play the survival mode for that game if I, like, now. I would totally do that. Um, but I don't know. I think four player co op shooters is just a genre that I really enjoy because it can be, it's competitive, but not versus each other, you know? Like it's it's got both teamwork and I don't know it's like it's 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 both it's it's mostly very fun, and not much past that. Also, horde shooter genres make you feel good because you get to kill lots of things, um, which is uh, kind of similar to so when people chat when you this is for the Warhammer fans out there when you play a game of 40k. Which army is your favorite to fight? Now, for the most part, most of you will most likely say Orcs, Tyranids, maybe Imperial Guard, um, and then and that kind of thing. And because of that, you realize the main thing, which is that they're all mostly hordes. Yeah, I see orcs, orcs and guard, orcs, guard absolutely, orcs, guard, etc. Um, because you get to kill lots of stuff. You get to kill lots of things. Now, if you uh, were to say what army is your least favorite to fight, I bet I would hear. I'll let you type for a little bit. Custodes, Imperial Knights, um, probably uh, Eldar. And Harlequins. What do we got here? Stodies, 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 Elves, 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 Stodies, Elves, Death Guard, Death Guard, Death Guard, Stodies. Yeah, yeah. Uh, mostly Sto. I see a lot of Stodies here, and Crons because Stodies and because Crons come back, and Stodies. Uh, you know, if he rolls good four ups, just don't die. And elves, you don't get to kill because they they fall away and you can't shoot them. Um, so, as I said, you know, it's fun to kill things. So horde shooters are a lot of fun because you get to kill lots of things. Even if those things aren't super important, there's still lots of things. Well, hey, Brick, I don't know if you've seen that Helldivers advertising with the entomolog entomologist, sorry. In fact, I actually met him several years ago. Uh, he did a talk at my university and afterwards some staff members, students went to a restaurant with him. He's a really interesting and funny guy. I have not seen that advertisement, but having a bug entomologist is pretty cool. Yeah. Tippity typity tip. Hey, 
Vicious Papaya, Requiem, and Smash Soul. Thanks for the resub. Thank you, thank you. Hey, Bricky, were you involved with Matt's plan to drive the crew into magic? Well, clearly not. I don't play magic. I just a few minutes ago got a notification that a commission I did for a custom stomp again. I think she has a stomper. 90% of it and I may or may not want it to go to a good home. Tay, I do not know. That would be a question you'd have to ask her on Twitter or Discord or something like that. I do not know. I mean, she ha I mean, she's very orc pill, don't get me wrong, but if she is that orc pill, I don't know. I'm not quite sure. Don't play magic yet. You know what? You say that. You say that. Okay, Bricky. Would you rather be a fantasy wizard in a sci-fi war setting or a sci-fi super soldier in a fantasy war setting? That's a very bizarre question. I, I will gladly be a sci-fi super soldier in a fantasy war setting. Absolutely. I'd much rather do that. Talk to the poor hammer guys again. <sighs> Chat, I've said this a million times. Uh, one bankrupting hobby at a time, please. Okay. Is it not enough for me to be into Warhammer? And you have to you have to get me into magic also. <laughs> you you yeah, you trying to get me to both. It's not enough. It's not enough for you. In our defense, it would be funny. In your defense, it's not. It's not enough that that I already have the one. <sighs> Brad feeds on suffering. He doesn't play Nif Drukari for that. You have an MTG Funko Pop. That's because when you gave me one, I didn't choose that. Speaking of forty k. A while ago, I found the IRL version of that Katakan who kept throwing grenades while injured, except even more badass. He was an Indian soldier during World War II called Jian Singh, who was injured but charged for honor, and did it Japanese for a bit. positions while throwing grenades. His superior told him to go back to receive aid, but he didn't want to until the job was done. I mean, uh, it's kind of baller. Reminds me a little bit of uh, a Detective Ridiculous episode that we're doing soon back in 2019 now i'm on the road to learning 3d printing to make an iron warriors army and also in planning on making something cursed i don't like those i don't like that statement i don't like the uh i'm making an iron warriors army and i'm planning on making something cursed because what's the first thing that comes to mind when we think about cursed iron warriors things oh no indeed Currently waiting for our turn to three-way battle. Our Chaos Marines versus the Custodians versus Tau. The Tau are obliterating everything. Yeah, Tau shoot. They do, in fact, shoot pretty hard. Who would have guessed that the biggest uh, flaw of Custodians being mostly their shooting uh, being used by Tau is uh, or reinforced by Tau is pretty scary. What new podcast are you starting this April Fools? Ah, good question. No, 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 no new, no new silly podcast this time around. Uh, same, same deal, Ridley. Play it soon, TM, usual. Though I have no trips coming up, so. I, I, well, tabletop wasn't that reason. Hey. Whatever keeps your mind off stuff. Whatever keeps your mind off stuff. That's all that matters. Yeah, the Polish sausage. I, I mean, I think I think for the most part, I'm taking a bit of a break because we just did all the remedy games. And and that was a that was quite the experience. That was a lot going on right there. You know? There were there was a lot. What do you think about the new two Chaos Lords? Uh, dude, the new, okay, the ground Chaos Lord looks great. He is awesome and su just super neat. The flying one, I don't much like. It looks kind of weird. He's kind of all like, Ooh. it looks weird. The movement's all off, uh, but I don't really care because I'm just going to get my 3D printed version of Lucorifice and just run that instead. 
you know, because all that matters is that now that you can run a jump pack Lord again, that is all that truly matters. Did I decide against a world leader's army? Oh no, I have a full 2000 points of it. I played it. They're just not painted. Yeah, tactical smoke. Weird. It's gonna break. I'll say Arbor. Thanks for the resub. Yeah. There's a uh, some shenanigans there. Anything else planned before the boomer shooter fest? It's just there's nothing really necessarily like planned, I guess. It's just once you get into it, you know, like how far do you go? How far do you go into it? We we just hired a brand new COO for the merch site on the Monday before I left for PAX. So we're getting him all up to speed and we're getting all the merch stuff going. We're also talking with some really big uh, possible people to do merch for and we're updating the site and, you know, we're signing on some new W2s that are incredibly expensive. And so they're like, like, like we're, yeah, we're making like moves, moves. We're making like moves in, in this world. And so immediately be like, all right, chat, I'm going to play nothing but boomer shooters for the next X and Y is a bit, you know, I don't want to go too far into it. So we'll see. We'll definitely see. Baby on board stickers on my Iron Warrior Rhinos. That's funny. That's very funny. CNC Renegade X. Check it out. You know what? Just for that, I'm going to play Command and Conquer 4 today. Just to hurt you. Bricky, what improvements do you think that Hellbreach Vegas needs to be big? Um, they need to fix all of their character animations and movement. Um, that, that it was really, it was very rough. It was very, very rough. The fact that everything was rubber banding like that as much as it was should not have happened. And that needs to be fixed ASAP. Bricky, call Matara. She is crying. How do you know that? One, why would you ask me to do that? Two, how do you know that? Three, what? What? Bricky, call other streamer immediately. They're Sag. <laughs> Four, what's her number? And five, touch grass. Uh, True Blooper and Platy Mage, which is the resub. You shit lords. I've been wondering since going back and watching all the PO box openings, what stuff do you still have? So, okay, someone that's that's great that you asked me that. Someone at the meetup asked me, Hey Bricky, do you still have the giant fist dildo from the old PO box openings? And the answer is yes. Um, so I, I do, cause I current, currently I, I do own a single rental property, one single rental property. I, I lived in it before. It was the old place back, back when I, being a landlord is not a real job. That being said, I do still own the one. Um, and, uh, my tenants there, uh, they, we, we you know, like the, the drawers you open above the washing machine and dryer that you normally have, you know, the little drawers you put up top. It is in there. It is still in there. Uh, it has been like seven years and it is in there. What a time. What a time. Also, hey, Huntman, thanks for the prime sub. As a masochist who did both, Vanguard Zombies Camera Grind. As a masochist who did both, Zombies Camera Grind. And, uh, uh, Scissor, I haven't played a lick of either of those zombies past my video, so I got nothing for you. That's on you. You gotta make that decision. At the rental property? Hey. They're, they're okay. The people who are renting it are like my my friends from high school. Okay, they're they're friends of high school. They just the rent's cheap. I don't I don't I don't charge them out the ass. So it's it's not it's it's not like Susan and James with their four kids are making sure to keep my fist dildo in their fucking laundry room. Okay, it's like daddy, daddy, what's this? It's like oh oh uh, uh, honey, don't touch that. That's very special. It's like is that what mom used on you in that one night when you couldn't walk? It's like oh <laughs> no 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 no. It's just a group of friends. And if they get rid of it, I'm hiking up their rent. 
Uh, IQ, thanks for the resub. All I can see is Bricky. I had the blues and was watching your reviews again and the algorithm gone insane so every next video is yours, even if it's the same video I just watched. Detox also, symptoms like detox Seth? Symptoms like Sith. <laughs> detox symptoms like Seth, okay. D does this, does sex give you detox symptoms? For me it gets me high. If I ever watch a Seth video I feel like I've immediately drank like a pound of lean. It's like... Just this, this kind of like, whoa, whoa, man. I guess Endless Space 2 does have fish tits. Wow. All right, I'll turn the goddamn TTS up, chat, you whiners. No. Oh. That's me with, with Haxor vids. Is Haxor Maxor? Did you just spell it wrong? Or is that like an inside joke? I can't, I can't do Maxor vids. Okay, I, I can't do them. The ha Maxor, it, it pushes over the cusp of like ADHD hyper. I, I, I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. He, he, he appears to be an incredible editor with great, with great scripts and all kinds of stuff. I just I can't, I just can't. Nothing wrong with him. Absolutely nothing wrong with him. It is simply content wise. Sometimes you just can't do it. <laughs> this fucking that comment. Maxor is the only content creator that can give me a migraine. <laughs> the Eigner, the Geller field is always down. You are just old. Brother, I am in my 20s. Ricky, who's next on the VTuber collab list? Okay, so, so, you know, caught, hands up, um, a remind, a very important reminder, uh, I, I do not much reach out to others about collaborations, um, because I, I am embarrassed to do so, um, and I feel like I'm, especially, especially when the content creators are larger than I am, especially when it's that, um, so for the most part, whenever a collab happens, it's because somebody else most likely Matara is dragging me kicking and screaming across twitch.tv. So it's uh one of the, you know something along those lines that normally occur. That but do you enjoy collabing with VTubers? Oh yeah. Oh absolutely. So okay, so so you know what? Here okay, you know what? Here's here's the deal. Here's the deal when it comes to VTubers, right? You all know me, anime, don't really go together. And, and so for the most part, I just never watched VTubers. I don't watch much Twitch TV in general, but I also didn't watch VTubers because if I don't watch Twitch, why would I add anime to it? That's like making a, a dish you already hate and then adding s too much salt. Um, but the thing is, and I, and I found this out, the more I've learned about different kinds of um, VTuber organizations is that one of the biggest things that I was always a bit uh, about with VTubers was how much of Japanese idol culture is in it and how like pristine and perfect it is. And that goes into the fans as well. The fans can get really hyper parasocial about it and very creepy with it. But now that I've talked to all the V Shoujo people, well, not all of them, like half of them, I realize, like, no, 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 these are not like VTuber personalities. They are personalities that happen to be VTubers. I'm not watching VTubers. I'm watching just other fucking streamers that happen to have a character. You know, it's no different than, than watching any other streamer that puts on a facade. They're just people. And like, don't get me wrong, the other VTubers are also just people, but there's none of that. There's a lot less of that parasocialness to it, a lot less of that like idolization stuff. And it took me a little bit to, to realize that until the more of them I watched and I was like, wait a minute, they're just fucking people. They're just, they're just, they're just folks that happen to have an avatar, you know? And it's, it's, it's quite nice. It's so, you know, I, I've, I had my, the incorrect assumption with other people that I've hung out with so far, you know? It's different depending on each individual's, but, uh, and you know, you know, you don't know how to act with certain folks. Um, but the moment, you know, but the moment I met like, like Haruka, 
and Zen. And I was like, oh, okay. Okay. I I see. I see now. This I don't need to I don't need to be worried. <laughs> and it was that day that Bricky became 5% less racist. Explain? Huh? What do you mean? <laughs> Goaded fucking shatter right there. Unlike Bricky, the V Shoujo people are actually fucking people. <laughs> Absolutely fucking Giga Chad shatter right there. Uh, Block Spot and uh, Rafa Pukula. Thank you so much for the resubs. <laughs> no, Dino Man, the uh, collabing with like with VTubers and like GPTV, for example, it's, I mean, they're just different groups for the most part. You know, one of them is an in-person group. They have like a, like a group schedule type thing. The other one is like, you know, individual personalities and stuff. It's just, it's like just different streamers. It's like join group A, group B is same stuff. You know, Ricky being a racist is my favorite joke in chat. Yeah, I fucking, what was it? It was like the game awards or something. And then chat's just like, wow, Bricky, you sure hate Asians. And then everyone in chat just decided to be like, that's so funny. It's so funny that, that Bricky might hate the Asian people. Let's run with that and gaslight him for three fucking hours. Why did you guys do that? Why did you do that? There was no point to it. No, I remember why. It was because I, I saw like an anime game and I said, ew, and you were like, wow, Bricky hates the Japanese. And then you just ran with it for hours. <laughs> why, why would you do that? And it scares me too, because you, you make those statements and then random Joe Schmo viewer is gonna go into Twitch and be like, oh, hey, it's that Warhammer guy. I know Warhammer's had a bit of a of a bad touch lately, or not lately, in, in general, kind of like a no girls allowed, little weird opinions people, but I'm sure Bricky will be totally okay. They walk in there and the first in the first fucking message is like, I can't believe that Bricky would so outwardly say slurs about about the Eastern cultures on stream and like Well, never mind, there's another one, another one bites the dust. <laughs> Fuck you. Why me times? Thanks for the prime sub. So I heard that the Battlefront Collection remaster wasn't so hot, eh? Nope, and it got 30k views. Yay me. Gaslighting is chat's ult. <laughs> chat's ult. The spit take about Final Fantasy doesn't help? No, 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 no. The spit take about Final Fantasy wasn't even a spit take. It was me choking and dying because I saw, I saw a, a buster sword and and then and then Horizon from Apex Legends looked out behind it and say, "Here we go, Nuti," and I fucking shit myself on camera. It caught me off, so off guard. It was uh, there were it was so unexpected. <laughs> Apparently, the event was really fun though. Uh, I I gave up on Apex. I mean, I'm sure it was all right, but. Apex is like crumbling over its own weight for me. Also, it's so expensive. The microtransactions in Apex are so much money. Oh my God. There's so much. I don't know. That was weird. I don't know. It's, it's, you know, people, people talk about how expensive Warhammer is, but shit, dude, I've, there, I've seen whales spend so much more money on, on online transactions. Look at fucking Grand Theft Auto Five. <sighs> Hi, Bricky. By your channel a couple years ago, we invited my love for painting minis and obsessed with 40k. Glad to catch you live. Yeah, of course. I actually am considering painting some minis on stream sometime soon. We're building up a table for it and everything, so uh, we might actually end up getting some of that done. It should be fun. Yeah, I enjoy myself. Uh, the table's supposed to go over here. Um, Actually, chat. I I haven't showed you guys this. You might want. To, it's it's right here because I was I was showing a a friend of mine the um the minis. But uh, um uh, I I had a commission done by Doctor Rhino, a fellow Warhammer painter on Twitch. Uh, he did my Void Dragon. It looks good. It looks really good. Nice. Oh, shit. 
Look at that. Look at that, dude. Yeah, yeah, he's he knows what's up. He knows what's up. That being said, I don't want to run this thing because Catan right now are bullshit. Chat, if you run more than two Catan in your list right now in 10th edition, you're dead to me. Grow a fucking, grow a pair of fucking Necrodermis nuts and run 60 warriors like a Chad. Or better yet, or better, or, or better yet, run your boy. Run your fucking boy, chat. Come on. Run your damn boy. The king himself. Zap. Hey, what's up, Abyss? Thanks for the Prime. Warhammer is a much better place when the Space Wolves are played by your local furry or Viking LARPer, not the guy with lightning bolt tats. Oh, yeah, yeah, the early 2000s. Yeah. Yep. That's, so that's, you know what the nicest thing about that is? Like, clearly, right, clearly Warhammer has had a bit of, a, of an identity issue. Uh, Imagine the Gathering has this issue sometimes too, but uh, it was such a niche hobby and, you know, much like a lot of other fandoms that uh, have fascist totalitarian satire people don't get it and they instead consider themselves in good company um there's an old saying um if you play the fool you will find yourself surrounded by fools who think they're in good company um now uh th this was a a very this was an issue that is a lot more prevalent back in the day uh but i am very i'm very happy with how many people seem to be getting into 40k from my videos because it's making it more a little bit more mainstream and while a hobby going mainstream isn't always the best often it's it's not great for a lot of reasons um it's good that like for the most part the annoying gatekeeping chuds um are being contained in their old man yells at cloud facebook forums that i never have to see because facebook is a dead social media to anyone under 45. um and so anytime there's any issue of bricky is is getting too big into the lgbt whatever warhammer etc it's something i ever have to fucking look at because it's being contained on uh aunt susan's banana bread recipe the social media platform so it's very nice it's very helpful and it's it's a it's a constant thing that i can uh i can i can you know be uh be, be pretty happy with um, now you will still have a few of those people in your local tournament but i think uh, not tournament and honestly actually uh you'll see it more in your local game store there'll be like that one or two weird person that just kind of hangs around the store and it's just a bit of an annoyance and you ignore them ironically tournaments are actually way more chill they've they've actually flipped tournament gameplay i've actually met significantly better and less weird people at tournaments i think it's because you have to you are forced to socialize for three hours to six different people over the course of a weekend you are forced to socialize you have to be have some level of social literacy in order to perform in one of those things and uh, I think it actually shows that a lot of times those games are really, really fun. Whew. Excuse me. Um, let's see here. Khaled gave 10 gifted subs. Thank you very, very much. Really appreciate it. Um, very, very kind of you. Um, Scylla's Flu, thanks for the five bucks. Gotta ask the heresy question. If you had to choose one of the Chaos Gods to serve, which would it be? Probably Slanesh. It's weird and, and, and creepy. And like the the regal excess is just kind of a neat vibe. If not them, then Nurgle. Uh, Rika, Bricky, I've, I've heard spits on Tau models. He sees the tournaments and called them a hoofed filth. He once punched Farsight in the stomach for existing. This is another one of those fucking racism jokes. God damn you. I've heard both sides of this. Someone recently told me, quote, the reason people go to tournaments and don't want to play them at local stuff, cl local clubs. So, you know, ironically, that kind of weeds people out though the ones that no one will play at local clubs generally get ostracized from tournaments because he they either get like 
ground into the dirt by good players that they that they can't you know and if they get salty about it everyone knows they get salty about it so they're kind of like you know like public opinion just kind of pushes them away um or you know if they if no one plays with them they 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 because they try to cheat or something these are people who are going to tournaments and they they know the game and so it doesn't work and then you get ostracized again there are weirdos in tournaments don't get me wrong but I, i've found way less of them than i expected most people just want to play it's like cool i can pay 60 bucks to play six totally different people i normally never play with and with totally different armies i normally never fight and I don't need to worry about scheduling conflicts, like with the D and D campaign, you know. Um, hello there, Brickle. Going back and forth. You stream Cyberpunk for a while. I'm wondering if you ever thought about playing it. Uh, yeah, I do plan on playing Cyberpunk. I just don't know when. Please, God, Bricky, do a paint stream. Also, I got accepted to GW's talent program to be a potential future heavy metal painter. Poggers. Ooh. That's a good time. I must sow the seeds of democracy through your soul. God damn you, Aiden. You shit. You shit, Lord. God damn you. Be up, Bricky, be honest. How was you in Modern Warfare 2 back in the day? Okay. You, you ask me, how was I with Modern Warfare 2 back in the day? How was I in what? My gameplay? For the things I said. Also, hey, Khaled, 55 more fucking subs. Let's fucking go. Thank you for the for the support. Really quite a bit. Thank you. Also, your boy Jamps, thanks for the prime. I got some 40 ber corn berserkers and have a lot of trim. Any tips to paint them fast? Maybe airbrush the trim on and then paint the red. The skill and, and things I said. So I, I was good. I was a good, I am a good COD player. That's one game I am good at. I am good at COD. I am good at classic shooters. I am good at like team deathmatch style shooters. I am, I am good at those. I, I know what's up. Um, I have no, Floof, I have no idea who the fuck Smolder is. I've never heard that name in my entire life. League of Legends, go away. Um, thanks for the donation. Um, I don't know what that is. Or is this you admitting to slur slinging? Only one slur. Only one. And that was the F word. Uh, I never used anything past that. Uh, but the uh, but the F word slur was uh, basically like the most common thing you ever heard back in the MW2 days. That was that was basically the only one. Hey, I, I admit to it. Hey, you caught me. You caught me. I admit to it. I admit to it. You know, everyone did that. Everyone used that one. That was that was old cod. That was as synonymous with bitch. Yeah, no, nothing, nothing past that. Never. Uh, no, I mean, you know, granted, there's there's a lot of other things being said, but no, those weren't mine. No, those were those were not mine. It was really normalized. Yeah, it was a super normal phrase. It was. Uh, I don't I don't know why or like nothing really changed. I think people just started using it. Like it was, you know, common in like the '80s and stuff, uh, but it, it was like it like meant something. Like it was in the '80s, it was like fucking, you were sticking it to them, um, uh, from like a phrase thing. But like then it just became as much as asshole, you know. Ricky is a pansexual man. I give you the f word pass. Thanks. Should I print it out and put it on my wall? <laughs> Hey James Norska, thanks for the reason. Also tell my brother this is my domain. Mine. Domain. Domain. No nodders. No nodders, chat. No nodders. <laughs> Frame it in gold leaf. <laughs> Callan. What is up with the subs? Why? Any particular reason? You just feel like doing it? Just, just gonna, just gonna get top, top gifter for the end of March. Started a train. Oh, a hype train. Oh, well, sorry, chat. We're not, we're not VTubers up in here, so our hype trains are a little different. You know. 
our hype trains aren't as uh they're not as powerful i should probably change my my viewer settings for our hype trains I really want to <sighs> we should we should use something that's a bit more um there's, there's, there's a way to make like hype trains like easier and stuff. Um, I think we're at like medium. We should probably just put it to easy, you know? Like, why not? Let's just, just do it. How the fuck do you do that? Twitch's UI isn't terrible, Liz. It's not, it's not great. Uh, subscription bonus, subscriber badges, community, community hype train. Here we go. Um, the difficulty for your hype goals. Higher difficulty requires more to complete. Oh shit, we're on hard. Oh crap. Oh, oh, it's not that big of a difference. Oh, never oh, never mind. It's not that big of a difference. Okay. Save changes. The hype train has been changed. So so okay, hard is medium. There's five. It goes easy, medium, hard, super hard, and insane. So we were we were mid we were, we were in the middle. We were in the middle. I thought we were we were at all right, we're at easy now. We're at easy now. I don't know if it changes this current hype train though, so eh, I don't know. You think this chat pussies? No, I don't think about them that much at all, actually. I really want you to do a Command Conquer 3 Kane's Wrath Let's Play. Yeah, you know, like RTS game campaigns are fun, but I don't know how good they would be for Let's Plays. Unless we did Red Alert 3. I might do Red Alert 3 because it's so stupid. Um, hey, so, oh shit slipped. Nah, Cal, I got you. Oh, 95 months slipped. Good God. 95. When that hits 120, that's 10 years, a decade. Jesus. Rick, you wanted to make bad life decisions, so I supported you. That is certainly a bad life decision. Going back to Pain, you see any of the Golden Demon uh, winners? Their sword winner was absolutely amazing, as always. Yes, I did. Ooh. One moment. Uh, yeah, I did. It was uh, it was quite something. It was quite something. Um, the the fucking uh, painting competition was absolutely insane. Oh, uh, hey hey hey, Rhino, what's up? I was just showing off your uh, your stuff over here. Um, yo, okay, <laughs> uh, awkward timing. Um, uh, Doc is currently on hold with a fucking um with a with a uh, with one of our support uh, crew for one of our machines. And they've been they've been giving him the runaround for a bit. He should I'm sure he will answer very soon. <laughs> it, it was is is being a a, a real a real uh, shitter right now. Um yeah just to, just to give you a heads up. Um and hopefully it'll be done soon. But yeah we, we were showing off your fucking um we were showing off your fucking uh, uh Void Dragon and, and Zarek. I, I'm gonna need to message you again so I can get so I can get the um how you did the paint. Again, because I use like airbrushed like the metallics, I'm pretty sure, however it was. And I need to remember how as close as I can to get that finished. Um, wait, what's what's going on? The AI golden demon controversy? Wait, what do you mean AI golden demon controversy? Golden demon AI. Oh, it's not the, um, oh, for the background back, the backdrop thing. Oh, okay. I, I thought, okay, well, maybe I'm an asshole by saying this. I thought we were talking about the, the Slayer sword winner and I got really worried because I was like, no, please. No, that is, that is the best thing. The best miniature I've ever seen in my entire life. And I got really scared. I'm like, no, of all of all things, of all things.
Oh man. Okay. Where is it? Yeah. So I, I'm, I'm about to show you the mini chat. Don't worry. I'm about to show you the mini. Fucking fuck you, Reddit. Um, okay. So this is the most insane thing I've, I've like ever seen. Uh, so this is the winner. The min I hate you, Reddit. I hate you. I hate you. Let me zoom in, you shit lords. Oh my god. Oh, one moment. I did open image in the two in another tab. It it didn't it, it it didn't. It just it just didn't. There we go, Warhammer community. Reddit moment. There we go. Uh this is the the gold the, the Slayer Sword winner miniature. So um basically it's like the main the main thing so you see this already right this is gorgeous beautiful miniature absolutely incredible right just just amazing stuff very very pretty this is not a mirror this is not an, a real reflection this is all part of the same miniature the guy the the guy i think it's a guy right alexandra yeah uh this piece right here is actually a very thin piece of like water translucent whatever the hell and then the bottom is another painted part of this miniature as a reflection and if you'll notice as a vampire their head is missing because they can't see their own reflection and there's also like a ghost on, on here and the hands are missing. And 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 also to to like be clear about this. We talked about this in the Advert episode. Um this is like this is a miniature here on the top, right? They don't make a mirrored version of this miniature. Like you can't just mirror this. You know? So they, they had to custom craft a mirrored version of this miniature and custom build it for the bottom side. They had to kit bash this thing. This, this might be the best looking miniature I have like ever seen. I, I don't think I have ever seen such creativity in my life. It's, it's so impressive. Alexander Dos Santos it is insane. Um, I will say, um, where is it? Uh, golden Demon. There is an Imperial Knight that won Golden Demon as well a while ago. Yeah, I have him. This is one of my favorites. Just, it's a, it's a vehicle. I just, I just really like this miniature. It just looks great. It just looks good. It's like, like it's nothing about besides the stance. Uh, it's like doing a head-on thing. Besides the stance, there's something like particularly different about it. It just looks good, you know. It just looks. It just. It's just clean. Of course, it's my favorite. It's the, of course, it's the Valiant. Of course, it's the Valiant. Plus, you got. Plus, the shading. Like, look, yeah, look at the shading though. You know, to shade like that right here. For all the like the deep and dark and recesses and everything. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot. It's cool. Rock. And stone. Tim Allen. Anyway. Um, yeah, it's it's good. It's really good. It does movement a lot better. It's it's pretty cool. <sighs> Oof. That's a... Uh, wait, why did someone at me about something? What have you done? Stream chat? What have you done? This is one of the landscapes at Adepticon. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude. What is this? I'm, I'm, I'm putting your photo that you put in the chat on uh, on stream. Holy hell. Oh, it's two, it's two parts. Holy hell. God damn. Like devil. Oh, jeez. 
That is insane. That's actually insane. Why even paint? Why why even paint, chat? Why even why why even try? Why even try? Also, I'm sorry, uh, but Twitcherman posted this earlier and I have to I have to like what the hell? Okay, so I'm sorry. Twitcher posted this earlier, which normally I would never post, but like, oh boy, I finally made top eight. Win or lose, I can't wait to review the VOD and improve myself for the future. The wretched Sage clops on commentary. Also, why is in my what's happening trending in the United States? We have the diddler. What the fuck is going on with the diddler? P. Diddy? Oh. That's right. I forgot about that. Weed jam moment. What is happening? All right. <laughs> All right, whatever. All right, chat. Oh, Centurion, Centurion Karn. Mr. Mr. Karn. Uh, thank you for that. Prime. The MILF man. What a name. What a goddamn name. Um, I'm going to go uh, piss my pants, chat. I'll be right back. Um, don't go anywhere or, you know, if you are, if you are, you know, start gooning. Uh, it's time for gooning, chat. I command it. Something. Opinion on the new jump pack, Lord. I have returned, chat! Alright. Scatter. You piss really fast? How- okay, how does it take you all to piss? I- I hear that all the time. I hear that all the time. Like, how long do you guys actually take to piss? Do you, guys, do you guys actually spend a lot of time in the fucking bathroom? Because I I don't. I, I want to spend as, li as little amount of time in the bathroom as I possibly can. Because the bathroom sucks. It's a boring room and, 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 and nothing fun happens in there. It is a, is a necessity and nothing more. Okay? I'm, I'm there to, to piss. That's all I'm there for. We're also going to watch YouTube shorts. I... <laughs> this is some... He ate without YouTube fucking stuff here. God damn it. Build a better bathroom? Build it. Cur build it with my own hands, huh? I see. The bathroom is as fun as you make it. To guy, you people. <sighs> we're playing Call of Duty Black Ops 3 now, and we're gonna play some uh, fucking um, new. Uh, we're gonna play some zombies. We're gonna play some zombies. We're playing zombies. Boy! We're gonna play zombies on a controller like God intended. Ugh. Play with Guitar Hero instead? How about you play with some bitches? Alright. 
Headphones on. Minorities oppressed. Ugh. Water achieved. It's gaming time. All right. Let's see here. Nice cock. Nice cock. Hey, Mr. Bucket, no. And Cola Farias. Thanks for the resubs. Chase Wilson. Thanks for the five gifted subs. Nope. You gave me five dollars. No gifted subs. You hate me. <laughs> opinion of the new jump pack lord. Hey, he's fine. He looks kind of shit in my opinion. He's boring. The, the, the idea is boring. I care more about the fact that I can use my old Lacorifice model. Chat, we're playing, we're playing zombies. Why are you playing zombies? Because I said so. I don't really care past that. I said I wanted to play zombies. We're gonna chat, we're gonna chat with chat. We're gonna play video games. Um, it's gonna be the usual kind of thing. And so as as all of the other uh, VTubers who are significantly better at streaming than I am start uh, ending their streams, I can be here so that you can watch someone significantly worse, but who still can uh, actually help you. Pog, as, I, as they say. Here's $10 more to prove I hate you. Thanks, Chase Wilson. I appreciate the 10 more dollars. It hasn't shown up yet, but I know it will. All right, solo game. What do we got here? Hmm. How, how are we gonna how are we gonna warm ourselves up, chat? How are we gonna how are we gonna get the get the, the hands flowing? To prove I hate you. See there it is. I told you it was coming. Moon? How the fuck is Moon? How the fuck is Moon a a, a warm-up? It's like one of the most stressful maps in the entire game. Yeah, chat doesn't know what they're talking about. Chat does not understand the Black Ops 3 nature of this whole thing. Chad does not get it. Kino would be the option, or like Derisa. We'll do that one. We'll do that. We'll, we'll do. Sorry, I mean the giant. Excuse me. Majority vote for it. How many? How many poll options can we get? Can we? Can, how, how many poll options can we get? This is it like four? Okay, new idea. It's five. All right, we're making a straw poll. We're, we're making a, a straw poll. Oh man, it's gonna take me a while to put all these in. Okay. Okay. Let's, uh, ascension. All right, there should be fourteen options, right? Shangri La. Moon. Origins, and then we have shadows. Of evil, Del Eisen Drake, Zetsubo Noshima, Baragrovi, Revelations. Bang. Last super chat, cuz I got the crude box to buy. You doing any chatter slash fan army or model reactions at some point? Okay. All right, chat. Here we go. All right, chat. Here you go. Can I get a pin for this one? Can I get a pin for this one, mods? YouTube chat. Break, uh, uh, the rest of chat. Here you go. They, oh, whoops. Wait, boy. It's the right. Got it. Okay. I'll, I'll let you pick three. You guys can pick three choices right now. You get you get three options. I hate you all. Damn, really? No, no rock lovers, huh? Wow. So, so see, they want to see Moon because I specifically said no to Moon, and so they're like, "Ooh, I want to do Moon." 
Also, um, uh, crew box chatter guy. Uh, none at the current moment, no. That might be a fun stream for later, though. Fan fan uh, painting reactions could be kind of cool. But how do you know it's the f the fan did it though? You know, how do you know that? How do you know they just didn't take a picture of something else? Uh, yeah, bitch and I shall receive, right? I mean, Origins is really high for obvious reasons. You know, Origins is very good. Little surprised by the Shadows of Evil, though. That's a, um... Like, Shad Shadows is a bit high, and th that's where, like, the votes really adjust. Everything past there, it's kind of, you know, it, it goes into a normal type of thing, but Shadows is high. I mean, I like Shadows, don't get me wrong, but I didn't think Shadows would be this high, you know? Do a little image background thing for each photo. No, it's gonna take so long. No. Berkey, so you want gifted subs on April? I mean, I love gifted subs in April, of course, but why, why does it sound like a... I guess we'll play fucking moon. Chat, let me make this clear. Die. No, you Peepo Brick. I thought Peepo Brick was like, was like me. I thought I was Peepo Brick. I am not. But in reality, you just, you just threw a brick at me. Oh, wow. Wait a minute, chat. This is running really well. This is actually running incredibly well. Thank you, boy. Thank you so much, boy. God damn, this game has so much aim assist. Oh, I'm fucked. Oh, okay. It's, it's okay. It's speed cola. It's speed cola. We're good. Wait, is the game really loud? Oh, just the alarm. Oh, yeah. Oh, the, the, yeah, the alarm is insanely loud. Yeah, the the yeah that, that that thing will really get you. That that thing will genuinely really get you. Ow. Holy holy gamers! Holy gamers! Wow, we are we are actually kind of gaming right now. How did I eat that? What? Oh, the gobble gum? That's is that the question you're asking? Is that is that where your uh it says bench of disbelief is heading right now? Oh, it's right where I'm playing on Black Ops 3. That means we gotta use the Shiva. Ah the Shiva. It's fine it just feels bad it's it's technically not a bad gun it just it just mm, it's, just, oh, it's just it's just so it's so unfun you know it's it's nearly an identical weapon to the m14 in almost every way minus a couple small changes like magazine capacity and that kind of shit but it's from like a a spiritual sound standpoint like a like a personal spiritual sound point it just it hurts me on the internally <clears throat> Well, RK5 gang is the best starting weapon when you can get it starting the game. Your chakras are off? Yeah, dude. Mercury is in uh, Gatorade right now and I'm all fucked up. You know, that's that's what I get for being a Gemini. Or as uh, as Matara once told uh, told me on stream, 
Ah, uh, I couldn't get waterboarded. The, I, that, you couldn't waterboard that out of me. But you know, it's very unfortunate. She was fucking throwing off my chakras, I tell you what. That's so asparagus for you to say. Aw, oh, thanks. That's so true, bestie. I'm not... Yeah, I'm mad about that. I'm not gonna lie. I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be perfectly fucking honest. I'm, I'm, I'm actually mad about that. I'm, I gotta be honest. I'm fucking tilted. I'm, I'm, I'm already, I'm already tilted. Uh, that, honestly, if I hadn't already started this quick, I would restart the game. I would restart the match already. If I, if I wasn't already here, and I already got like the dull points and stuff in the beginning, so there's, there's enough good. To make it worth not restarting. Actually, it all depends entirely on what's in the mystery box. If this is bad, I might just alt it for the game. No more ammo to treat the The L4 Siege. The L4 Siege. May your L's be many and your bitches few. Christ. Thank 250 bits from Gamer. Glad to join the moment you downed. Zombies. I, 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 dude, if we start Moon again and, and it, it drops um, Juggernaut, I'm going to cry. I'm going to make one very loud crying sound. Okay. Yo, Argentus Numus, thanks for the Prime sub. I appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Oh, this must be the place where they bake all the apple pie. Ah! Excuse me! God, so loud! Wait, I, I can pull this off. I can, I can pull this off. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! I'm so washed. I'm so washed. Yeah, I'm so washed. I'm so washed. I'm so washed. I couldn't pull it off. I'm so washed. I'm so washed. <sighs> ATO Anders, thanks for the five gifted subs. I, I really appreciate the support in, in today, today's day. I thank you so much for that. I prototype 965 with the prime sub, then Fayin with the gift the, the nine month resub. Thank you. Oh Jensi, I think I can see your house from here. It's on fire.
Dude, where are all the zombies spawning from underneath? Where is my points? Oh god. Oh god. This was such a bad start. insane cat it's just it's such a good starter map rookie it's such a good starter map it's it's fucking it's such a good time bricky just do the fucking moon first that was right there that was right there it, it, i was good i was out i'm over the moon for this loss time that man out for at least 30 seconds Americans will never gain my secret. God damn it. Where's where's the spawns? Oh my god. are not making it this time oh my god dude are you shitting me what was with that spawn what was with that dog spawn are you kidding me are you kidding me why you put him on <laughs> that was bullshit that was not me that was not me, chat. That was not my fault. That was a bullshit fucking spawn. That dog spawn was fucking trash. Okay? That was bullshit. I, I ain't hearing nothing. I, I ain't hearing nothing. All right. That was, that was fucking dog. That was, it was dog. It was dog. <sighs> Please play something you're good at. First time chatter he message. The only I'm good at. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Do not VIP them. Oh, oh, now. No, oh, now you give me the spawns. Look at this. Are you shitting me? Look at that, we have enough. We have enough and we don't even get fucking... <laughs> what excuse you got now? I don't, I don't have one. I don't, I don't. I don't have an excuse. That was me timing the teleport wrong. That was me fucking up the teleport. I don't have an I don't have an excuse. I'll start paying you to play a different map. We got one. We, no, we're gonna do one more. We're gonna we're doing one. We're doing it. We're going again. We're doing one more. We're gonna do one more. Okay. We're gonna do one fucking more. We're gonna do one more. I'm gonna get this. Hello. I just joined. Leave immediately. I don't want you here. Pies. Nolan North, shut the fuck up. Hey, I ATO Anders. What a sweet five gifted subs you've given me right there. That's very nice of you. Thank you so much for your support. It's very kind.
Okay. Okay. We're out. Chat, if alert is a 7TV emote, Slip does not put it in there. God damn it. Chat. Yes, I did. Did you? What? I don't see it on the fucking thing. Was it recent? This is this is everyone's fault besides me. Chat, a couple of you are are from Matara's stream, I'm, I'm sure, and, and probably sub to her as well. Can I get a fucking Momo despair? Hey, love the warm box you suggested in way back time. I know how you feel about suggestions from the peanut gallery, but Glenn Cook's The Black Company is right up your alley. Won't spoil it, but here's 50. Thank you. Tried you dirty coming. Glenn Cook's The Black Company. Okay. I have it in the I have it in the brain now. It's in the brain. I can consider this. I need revive soda. I don't have revive soda. We don't have revive soda. Thank you, chat. Thank you for the despair, Momos. Thank you. It's a it's a really good emote. It just just it's just a really good emote. God damn it. <sighs> okay. All right. We've made it. We are we are technically. I don't really remember how to turn how to make sure that we don't um I, I don't I don't remember how to turn off the fucking the drillers. I don't remember how to turn off the excavators. Hey Miss Tap, thanks for the resub. And more, thank you for the resub as well. And Polar Vortex, thanks for the resub. Tamirin, let me make this clear. That $50 you just donated me, me is the entire reason we're still streaming right now. If it wasn't for the $50 you just gave me, I would have quit a, a bit ago and, and, and fucking cried. I might still cry. Hacker tool to moon spawn on flashing green machines. Right, it's the hacker tool. That's right. That's right. That's right. I had to, I, I forgot about that. Have I played Funger? You mean kid named Funger? I must find ammunition. No fear and hunger. No, I have not played fear and hunger. I don't trust. I don't trust any of you telling me to play fear and hunger. I don't. I just don't trust you. I just don't. Okay, I can. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm saying I don't trust you. The very there's a very big difference. Where am I? Oh, there we go. Okay. Ah, the classic frame rate drop uh, whenever you turn on the power in, in zombies. What a classic. I have not played Gunfire Reborn, but that is, was easily the highest amount of comments I got on the RoboQuest video. Was, Berkey, if you like RoboQuest, you're going to love Gunfire Reborn. I kind of want to get the Argus, but I kind of want to roll the dice on the, on the box again. God damn it. Uh... God damn it. That, oh, yes. Oh, it's got the Evo site too. Oh. The, the, the Fafar. Yes. Thank God. Thank God. 
We can work with this. I listen. I like the Argus. The Argus is good. I'm 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 an Argus fan. Out of all the, I mean, it's not the best zombie shotgun out there. I mean, yeah, it's, it's no it's no 205 uh, bricky, um, bricky brecky, but it is it is good. It is very good. I like my Argus. KRM is also very good. It, honestly, most of the shotguns in in uh, Blops Three are pretty good. All right, where's the hell's the hacker? Oh God, that's right. We're in the Nova Crawler zone. That was that was way too dank. Of course, I know about Ultra Kill. I've also been told often to play Cruelty Squad, which I also know nothing about besides it being a trip. Oh God. I, I, I like that. I like I like that too. The the two ne ne uh, side by side messages here. Uh, Cruelty Swad goes hard, and then slipped right after that is oh fucking hell no. So we got a bit of a <laughs> differentiating opinions here. It'll break you like an iPhone screen. That sounds like something I would I would hope uh, for for a future partner to tell me, not a uh, random chatter. Don't hum me, chat. You heard me. Powder that makes you say real. I feel like if I feel like there needs to be a 7TV emote specifically of the powder guy. Specifically of the giant chin powder guy. For whenever someone says real. It's kind of like, like sometimes I see I, I go to other people's chats um, and then I and then I call them bad names and then I get banned. But then sometimes and other times I uh, go to other people's chats and then I see them uh, type where all lowercase just W H E R E where and uh, they're just asking where for some other question, but it auto uh, 70 V's it into the Pepe looking around in, in circles with the question marks around his head. And it's just great. It's just lovely. It's a, it's a fantastic look. Yes, yeah, see, see you guys you guys yeah, you guys have it there, but you have it in in all caps. See what I was what I found was someone had did it but they did it in lowercase. So it wasn't they weren't trying specifically do where. They were doing it in lowercase. So someone would just like say a random statement and then it would be like, "Hey chat, Pepe running away is this thing?" It's good. It's good. Yeah. Check and play when I had it in lowercase. Did they? There and wait, and you submitted to them slipped? Weak. I expected better. Hey, what's up, Vincent of England? Thank you very much for the prime sub. I appreciate it. Oh shit, where's the Wait, excavator. Where is it? Gimme, 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 We're gaming again. Hmm. Hmm. All right. That is uh, what the the kids would like to call suboptimal. Oh, hmm. Meeting is a lovely emote. Hmm, meeting is very good. That's up there. That's up there. That, that, that's got some, some chunk to it. 
Uh, you know what? I'm taking the Argus. Fuck it. Argus gang. Okay, now a couple things. One, I gotta find the last bear. I forget where it is. Actually, no, I think I, I think I know where it is. It's probably inside the um I think it's inside the biodome. Number two, um, we're taking double tap root beer because this is Black Ops 3, and double tap is actually good. Number three, um, where the fuck is the fucking hacker? I thought it spawns in the labs. Can't spawn the biodome? Nice try. I don't want to be in the labs. Only the labs? God damn it. I don't want to be in the goddamn labs because the goddamn labs has. Uh... <sighs> hey, Binks, thanks for gifting a sub. I don't know why you did that, but thank you. boy didn't have his balls out well that's that's fair that's because that's because i neutered them table no table 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 no table bro uh it's gonna it's gonna go into tunnels there it is found it Couple issues though, as we all know, you cannot use a hacker and a PES system at the same time. So uh we are we've got some issues here. I think the biodome is still uh survivable though, so we're gonna try to go to there. The trees in this place are not right. They should be removed. Yes, it is. Cool. So we got that done. But in order to stop decompression, we need to head back to the entrance and then touch the thing, don't we? To start to stop it from breaking shit apart. God damn it, which means I need to head back to God damn it. I, uh, I hate I hate I hate Moon. I hate this map. Okay, I can't actually go there right now because it's not been brought down. Oh, yes. Thank God. Okay. Did they, did they just choose not? There we go. Okay. Uh, we're, we're, we're actually like maybe gaming ever so slightly now. Ever so slightly. Hey, Hex. Thanks for the resub. That's so way too dank, dude. That's one. Touch, touch, touch. Okay. 
We're, we're gaming. All right, we're all right. We're actually gaming. We're safe. We're we we actually decided that we learned how to game. We learned how to be real gamers. Oh, coagulants! The most worthless gobble gum I've ever seen in my entire life. Longer bleed out time in my solo match. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point. We, we got four perks. We got the hacker. We we genuinely. That's right. I forgot. We can't actually, um, that area is not allowed. We, we do just need the zap gun. I don't know if we can survive long enough for that though. Can we, if I, oh no, if I put the hacker there, it, it just goes back to the rest of the world. No! We lived. Holy shit, we actually lived. Okay. I'm I am so lucky he died. That was that was it's pretty pretty sus. Okay, where is Yay? gonna kill me. I thought that was the end of me right there. Now to find ammunition. Oh fuck, it's P it's widow's fuck, it's widow's wine. That's right. Shit. I should have got that instead of speed cola. I forgot I thought it was flop. Flo it's it's flopper in the in, in the original BO uh BO1. Widow's wine. Widow's wine is awesome. You know, I could just go back down and pat and pap two separate guns right now. I mean, there's no reason not to. It's an option. All right, let's see if I can. Nope. It is still. Oh, hey, there's an insta kill. Why? Why does it do that? Why does it do that? Why does it send me like that? You can use the hacker on speed cola to remove it and get widow's wine. Can you? See, see, you could be lying to me right now, but I might believe you. You can also use it to turn guns upside down and other weird stuff. I don't know. I just, I don't know. Some ideas. You know what's the saddest part about playing BO3, champ? No Call of the Dead. You know what's the saddest part about playing Call of the Dead? Playing Call of the Dead. Call of the Dead? You lost some weight. Oh, thanks. They Maki, the Maki. I don't know how to say her name. Thank you. I, I guess it depends on when you watched me recently. Uh, the best part about the worst part about playing Call of the Dead is uh, playing Call of the Dead, though, because Call of the Dead uh, blows. Call of the Dead is one of those maps that nostalgia holds up almost entirely. Call of the Dead is not a very good map. I tell you what. Yeah, I, I mean, you know, first time chatter and all that. Don't get me wrong, uh, but but let me tell you, it, it's 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 interesting when you when you look at the old videos. Go go rewatch like the Frostpunk video, and yeah, there's there's it's been a difference. You would think they could have made this faster after all this time. That was my explanation for why you were being shot farther away than originally. Oh, damn it! They weren't actually referring to me. They were making a joke about the game. Sag. Well, yeah, everyone carries way in the face. This is how it goes. 
You want to make your face look slimmer? Just lose weight in general. It'll work. Hey, Bricky, long time viewer, first time in Shire. I just wanted to ask, why? You know what? Let me, you, you know what, MLG Chicken 420? Why indeed? Why indeed? Oh, right, it's slide, not dolphin dive. Oh, right, I, oh, I, gotta, I gotta remember how to do the, um... Oh, I can kind of still do it. I can still kind of do the slide cancel. I don't know. I don't, you know, how long do I have to survive with no... I actually survived longer than I expected. As a certified fat fuck, I feel that. What the shit? Oh, it's just about the, the, the losing weight in the face thing? Uh, okay. Um, Jesus Christ. It is true though. Uh, so it, it, I actually haven't lost any technical weight. It's just I've worked out at the gym a lot. So it's just the, the weight has been distributed to other parts of the body. And you know, muscle weighs more than fat, the usual type of thing. All right. I, okay, chat. I'm going to be perfectly honest though. So so I, w I was. All right. I was. You, you, chat, who is your streamer's favorite streamer? There's one, there's one answer to this. Who's your streamer's favorite streamer? Dad. That's not correct. But, but, what, but, yeah. All right. Chat's getting it now. Chat, Asian bunny. Well, not anymore. <laughs> um, you, you, chat, you are correct. It, it, the answers are two. It's either German or Northern Lion. Correct, correct. Uh, but if we're doing the Northern Lion world right here, there was the, the DoorDash conversation. We talked about this a little bit earlier about the whole good times make weak men type thing. Um, that whole deal. Now, now see, I'm, I am someone who has ordered a lot of DoorDash in my time. I am a Twitch streamer. Uh, as well as other things. I have ordered a lot of DoorDash in my time. I am aware of the cost. I am aware of the stupidity of it. Sometimes it is simply a better decision. Uh, most sometimes I am just motherfucking lazy, but other times, uh, yeah, I am really, really busy and the 30 to 45 minutes it would take for me to leave and go get it uh, is necessarily worth the cost in whatever I'm doing at that time. Uh, also, because I'm in a better financial position than the, uh, you know, the average uh, American, etc. More, 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 so on and so forth. That being said, my most recent DoorDash extra extravaganza has become problematic. I have become fully addicted to caramel apples. Now... In my DoorDash area, uh, there is a place called Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory. I'm not sure if any of you have that chain near you, uh, but basically they sell lots of different types of chocolates. Um, now, they also have a large variety of caramel apples that are for sale. Not just regular caramel apples, but also things like caramel apples with Oreos uh, surrounding it. Caramel apples with dark chocolate. Candy apples. Um, caramel avalanche apples, which are like caramel nuts, mu um, marshmallows, and, and drizzle. Unfortunately uh, for this Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory near me, it is located deep within a mall. So even if I did want to go get it, it is even doubly a pain in the ass because I have to go through the park often very far away because the mall is very busy. Walk a long distance, go get my apples and go back. It's, it's at least a 45 minute to an hour excursion in order to get these apples. So I perchance have maybe ordered a good bit of app of caramel apples in my time uh while partaking in in particular recreational drugs now unfortunately as a as a doordash dash pass subscriber there is often a dollar limit or a dollar minimum to get a major discount from these apples this is generally around 30 dollars um however Often, um, these apples are between 10 and $9. 
Um, and so three whole caramel apples is not enough to reach the difference. And if I were to buy a fourth caramel apple, it would basically equivalent the costs or be equivalent of the cost of the apple. Now, the question that I see Chad is asking the most right now is, Bricky, how many apples do you have in the fridge? You are mistaken and, and completely missing the earlier statement I said. I am partaking in recreational drugs. Do I eat all four caramel apples in one night sitting while watching uh, a video essay about the guy who tried to fake discovering a brand new element of like a two hour long documentary type thing. If you, if I were to testify in front of court, I would plead the fifth. So Have I eaten four full-sized caramel green apples in a sitting before? Yes. Have I done this just once? Well, that is a different question entirely. And my personal assistant that helps with lots of my content or you know emails and stuff has called me out for ordering large amounts of rocky mountain chocolate factory apples because the emails arrive as she checks and filters my email box for me have i possibly gotten to the point that I am hiding my caramel apple Rocky Mountain chocolate factory addiction by purposely making sure to immediately delete my order confirmation and order delivery emails the moment they arrive so that my assistant cannot laugh at me for ordering large amounts of caramel apples at 9.30 p.m. I might have... Do, am I attempting to justify my actions? No. I want to make this very clear. I am not some DoorDash sympathizer or anything. I am aware that I am being a lazy piece of shit and, and, and making sure that I am under the nose of my assistant hiding my caramel apple addiction that has happened minimum five times. However, uh, sometimes the most important step to stopping your problem is talking about it. So I just wanted to express myself. I did it last night. If I were to spin this in a positive manner, it's important for everyone to always remember. It's important for everyone to always remember that um, streamers are not infallible people and are just like you. They have just the same types of flaws. So when I get canceled for, you know, beating a man to death with caramel apples, I'd like you to remember that I am not perfect. Mm, I think that digging thingy is going to remodel this ring. Personally, I'm a slut for salt and straw ice cream. Watch this. The doctor is airborne. Okay, so... 
How many apples? Okay, so... One moment. Um, yesterday in my, in my, in my, in my bag from the Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory, um, there was an additional item in there and, uh, that item was, was a stamp card because apparently they have now realized that I've, ordered as much as I have from them and so they sent me a stamp card at, uh maybe to um as you can see there are uh four holes four holes in the the back of the stamp card and so um I feel like this might be my uh moment of clarity I, ah. Uh... Night cock. Night cock. 16 apples. Night cock. So that's Night that. Uh, I told you this at least five times. So that would actually be about 20 apples. Um, I, I, I will say that I have, uh, so, um, I'd like to, so someone mentioned salt and straw ice cream. Ice cream was my my main go-to. And ice cream, but ice cream is so calorie dense. Um, no, caramel apples aren't not calorie dense, but a good portion of that is still apple. You know? Like the fruit. So I I get set back a lot less. Um when I eat the the four caramel apples, then I do the the ice cream. <laughs> Buy nine caramel apples, get one free. We're almost halfway there, chat. Look up their caloric content. It's a fruit with a shitload of sugar. Lots of sugar isn't bad, you know? Like, eating lots of sugar isn't terrible. In general, like, you know, like just so long as you, all right. So let me, let me, okay. It is not great. I'll, 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 it is not great. Um, can I, okay. So I'd like to, I'd like to give myself a little bit of a credit here. I, I, I do not eat like this for the rest of the day. I eat good old healthy meats, you know, like, like, like vegetables a good 70% of the day I, I eat well. This is this just happens to be like every like week or so, I might, you know, partake in a couple apples. So it's just, you know, it's 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 not often. It's just, you know. It's fine. I brush my teeth every night, every morning. I floss. I have to. It's a lot of apple skin that gets stuck in the teeth.
What do you mean C? What is C? C for caramel? $180 spent on apples? You can't... You can't refer to it like that. You can't be like, oh, Bricky spent $180 on apples. It's not just the apple. That, that that's, not, that's not the same. See you getting fatter. I'm all right. I work it off. Are you? Mostly. Caramel apple stream when? What do you mean by caramel apple stream? Like, 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 what do you mean? Uh, no, I I'm sorry. You have your memes wrong. It's Carl on duty, Black Cops 2. If you're gonna pull out some some 2012 humor, you gotta do it right. Just two hours of apple eating? What do you have him do a sponsored stream? Yo. What if wait? What if we reached out to Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory for a sponsored stream? That was a really nice dono. That was a, or snarf. That's a hundred dollar really kind dono. Thank you so much. I I thought you were gonna donate money to uh, be like, hey Bricky, here's a hundred dollars for you to fucking like eat nine thousand apples on stream. Ha 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 ha. You know. Okay, we're gonna go for the we're gonna go for the ray guns. Hopefully, we can survive with no air. Nope, not a ray gun. All right, looks like we can't do that. Looks like we need a suit for it. If we want it, we want to, we want to hit the fucking box. We need a fuck. Are you shading me? My boy. You're going to hit me with the, the Nova crawler bomb smash combo. I fucking love Nova Crawlers. Moon is such a good goddamn map. Holy shit. Nova Crawlers. Love it, Treyarch. Wow. Maybe, maybe we need more. Maybe we didn't have enough apples. How do you like them apples? Treat yourself to some Zetsubo. Treat myself? Treat myself to Zetsubo Noshima. 
<laughs> Oots chat posted. <laughs> Bricky's fridge right now. <laughs> Bro. How much did that get that? Wait, Cabal, you said how much to get that kind of stream? What, the, the Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory sponsored stream? Also, uh, uh, Orsnarf, thank you, though, seriously, for the, the really generous dono. Good luck on your PhD, especially. Very, very good luck to that. Thank you. Uh, little Broomstick, thanks for the resub as well. Ricky, uh, hey, Ricky, I had an okay ish day. I was wondering if you could see Plant Cam again. Typical Bricky. Thanks, Arathorn. No, just the apple. Uh, Bricky out here, apple maxing. God damn it. There's your plant cam chat. I mean, what do you what do you want, Chad? Do you want me to just like get more apples? Oh, did I miss Young Almighty? Thanks for the Prime sub. And was it Miss Wolfie? Wolfie? Thank you for the Prime sub, also. I appreciate those both. You just want me to buy more apples? Whoa now. He was here. Now he's gone. He will pay for what he has done. Mark my words. I am glad you are happy with plant cam. Unfortunately, it appears to cover my fucking points. It, it appears to cover my points, so uh uh we're gonna have to we're we're gonna have to turn off plank. <sighs> There you go. Nothing is up there. That's an easy spot to put it. When Apple Cam? This is why I should never tell chat anything. <laughs> I can hear Satan's <laughs> I can hear Satan's calling me. He's saying to invest in Apple. What does it mean? Why is you want me to buy apples? Station 35. Absolutely goaded chat message. Absolutely goaded chat message. Very, very good reference. Yeah, yeah, this an apple a day keeps keeps the doctor away. And uh and, and four caramel apples a day will will uh, keep me away from the doctor. Oh, right. I already bought the Shiva. Oh, shit. I'm stupid. The chat would have never known that. This is very good choice for KRM shotgun. Very good. I must find way to survive this it's life. fine. I'll be, I'll be mostly but Apple by the time we're done. Asperus and Tima, thanks for the resub orders. as well. Welcome back. BO2 versus BO3, which one is better? Uh, that depends on what you're asking. If you're asking about zombies, BO3. If you're asking about general multiplayer, uh, BO2. If you're asking about campaign, I'd also say BO2. This is true socialist reform. 
BO2, see, the thing about BO2 zombies is that it's either very, very, very good or very, very, very mid. Because BO2 zombies, if, if we remember our, our, you know, chat, remember your list of, of maps, right? So you got, you got transit. You got transit, which is no matter how fondly you remember it, bad. I, 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 there's no better way to put it. Your nostalgia clouds your vision. It is not good. Um, it is not, it is not good. Apple cat run. I don't know, I don't know what's going on here. Um, you then after that, I, it's, I, I can't see it on the seven TV yet. Um, I can't see it yet. Um, then, then you've got, well, you, you go, okay. After that, you have Die Rise, right? Which, in my opinion, is the worst. Oh, is it worse than Transit? It's not good, but it's got some redeemable qualities. It has some redeemable qualities. I don't know. My man's like Hans Doofenshmirtz dunking broccoli in gravy. My man's like Hans Doofenshmirtz dunking broccoli in gravy. I gotta be honest, my friend. That you just saying that right there, like fucking. That threw me off. Is that the one with the rooftops? Correct. Die Rise is the one with the rooftops. Um, is the one with with the the slick with fire and all those. Yeah, it, it's it's bad. It's bad. Um. It also has the jumping jacks, and it's just it, it has one of the. It has a goaded perk, but no one ever survives long enough to use it. Um, let's see what else. Oh, hell yeah. The bri the bricky. Um, but then after those two maps that are generally relatively mid, you then got Mob of the Dead, which is a top three map in all of Zombies history. And then after that, you got Buried, which is like good it's it's a it's a bit hit or miss um because some people really like buried uh i think buried's a little too easy it also requires a lot of setup but it's like the setup is easy so it feels a little bit tedious um but then after buried you then have uh what is it um origins which for most people is the best zombies map of all time it's my personal favorite So, Black Ops 2, it's like highest highs, lowest lows. BO, uh, BO1, I think is like, is pretty, is pretty good. BO1 is like consistently good to okay. Nothing is like terrible in BO1. I, I really don't like Shangri-La, but you know, um, but you know, like it has Kino. Kino's amazing. Five is hard, but people like five. Uh, you also have Ascension, which is great. Call of the Dead is okay. I don't like Shangri-La, but you know. Uh, then you have Moon, which, uh, well, you know, it's hit or miss, as we saw. BO3, I think, has the best collection of maps, but they're also uh, a bit easy. Though, I think they're a bit easy because of the gobble gum. They're actually pretty... They're, they're a bit, bit tough if you don't have gobble gum. Yeah, well, B BO3 contains all of World of War, most of uh, Black Ops two, uh, 1, and also Origins. So it generally contains some of the best maps. Hey, Bricky, did you try Sigma Brain? Okay, I got, okay, I got, let me just, let me just say this here. You, first time chatter, by the way, uh, named Berserker OW, which I imagine is Overwatch, uh, with the Overwatch League 
icon next to your name. So we got pro Overwatch fan or something of that nature, which already has me at odds with you for a second. What the fuck is Sigma Brain? You have about 35 seconds to redeem your name. Gamer subs taste. Is there a gamer sub flavor named Sigma Brain? Oh, there is. Oh my God. Oh, it's H3, H3? Of all... Of all the fucking flavors for H3, H3 to create, Sigma Brain is not, like, the brand I would have expected? But, like, it looks, it looks like... But, like, but, like, Overwatch player person in chat... It looks like Sigma. Like, it looks like it would be like, like Dutch ass Sigma. You know, from Overwatch. That's, oh, geez. Okay. Uh, what's the, what's the flavor? Grad zesty lime and a gradual controlled heat. So it's like a spicy flavor. I, that's just not what I expected. Well, cause like, you know, you go to, you go to gamer subs, you get like just melon, which has boobs. And then you get good, just called good, which is from, you know, uh, Smithy and then anime girl thigh, you know, from Flork. And then you get pay money wubby and shy Lily. And they have a jujutsu Kaisen one. Um, you, Grandpa's Ashes from Soda Poppin' and Guacamole Gamer Fart. Uh, there's your boy, Sweet Six Pack right here, bada, bada bing. Um, oh wait, no, Grandpa's Ashes is not Soda Poppin'. That's so, de so depressed pear. Oh, it's goons. That's right, it's goons. You also have Lean with Joe Biden. Because that, that's fine, I guess. And then you get Schlatt, of course, team, et cetera. I, I just, I did not know that, that that just threw me off. All right. What a world. God damn. No, no, I have not tried it. I have not tried Sigma Brain. Soon you will be the same. I have not tried it before. I'm too old for those things. I mean, fair. Some of those the memes are, they're, they're very, they're very much some Zoomer memes. Don't get me, don't get me wrong, but I am proud of my flavor. I, I do think it's very good. And I'm I'm biased as shit, but I, I think it's pretty alright. Brother, I'm 33. Well, I'm 28, so like and I'm part of this train, so. I don't know what you want from me. What's my flavor? Uh my flavor is sweet six pack. It's got a bunch of muscular women on it. Uh, that being said, it's, um, uh, it is a cherry pineapple and it's actually really, really good. I, 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 I actually think it's fucking amazing. We got, we, oh, that's right. We got the, the, the dubstep version of this, uh, of this one. Wait, 20? I thought you were 38. I must apologize. Salahan, you've been a sub for like five years. You've grown up with me. I can see that <laughs> We've been here for... <laughs> That's fine, whatever. 
Ah, here it is. The favorite zombie secret song? That's a tough one, man. Beauty of Annihilation is pretty up there. Revelations, the gift is really good. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I actually am a very big fan of Alone uh, in, in Cold War zombies. I, I don't know what it is. Cold, that first Cold War map was really good. Cold War Zombies is underrated. Cold War Zombies is underrated. It's it's not like normal zombies. It's different, but it's not bad different. It's just different. BO4, ironically, is not too much different, but it's bad. Except for like, um, it's Dead of Night. I think it's kind of okay. I forget. Do you think COD Zombies uh, is generally seen as better than Killing Floor? Different games. Uncomparable IMO. One of them is a, is a more uh, difficult kind of multiple type of enemy horse shooter type thing focusing more on management of ammunition uh, or more emphasis on like class based characters and stuff like it's classes and weapon classes and things like that uh, healing your teammates that kind of thing where this is more of like an arcade yeah, zombies is almost like a roguelite if I'm being totally honest it has those kind of qualities to it Nailed it. No, you, you you go in, you you start you start the map. You get a little bit of uh, the enemies spawn. You pick a different run style each time. You get a little bit of randomness with the mystery box. God fucking damn it! It is a it is kind of like a light rogue light. I forgot I didn't have Jug. That was close. This is your destiny, yeah, well, some of the maps in BO3 were not too bad, no. But, uh, sorry, BO4. Um, but a lot of the... The issue is not the... The, the maps for so to speak it's more like well how you play it in the maps just feels bad also god dude the ui in that game was so ugly holy fuck holy fuck the, the ui was so ugly and the perk system yeah the, the hud was really bad perk system was not very good hud was not very good i feel like crafting the various fancy side weapons was kind of neat I didn't hate that like you know how they made the Ragnarok DG4 its own kind of thing that was alright they did get kind of creative with some of the maps like Dead of Night and stuff where we're not too bad but 9 was kind of cool but it's just I don't know I think BO4 is when people started to really turn on CODs it's like all right now you you got you got rid of the um you got rid of the campaign in bo4 and now the zombies isn't very good either we're we're now we're going we're, we're going down 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 infinite warfare nah I, uh. you see the thing about so the thing about infinite warfare though is that um you had the cod 4 remaster yeah, the COD 4 remaster that came with Infinite Warfare, and so people didn't quite turn on it yet. There was a saving grace there. So. I don't know. I'm buying this. Well, World War II? Yeah, World War II sucks, don't get me wrong, but... The next, World War II Zombies, I don't know if it's sight. World War II Zombies was just, like, the most generic zombies of all time. 
in fact it, it was honestly one of the the more the, it was almost worse than being bad it was boring hey silly duckling also your boy sandy thanks for the uh, prime says both of you also healthier the mad congratulations skull for the skull throne and pulse B. thanks for the reason what theme for a zombies map do you think would be awesome that your dreams your dream zombie map essentially that's well, not really a, dr a dream zombie map requires a little bit of like creativity in terms of um like concept conceptualization and stuff and mechanics uh but i don't know i mean a lot of the art direction in in zombies is just good Partic I mean, Mob of the Dead is some of the best art direction in the in the zombies, but Black Ops 3's art direction is actually kind of baller. You know, you get like diesel punk German castle, uh, uh, German Nazi castle, and then you had Cthulhu Art Deco Night Roaring Twenties. You yeah, you had a uh, uh, mythical fantasy dragon Stalingrad, uh, and then. Revelations was actually a little bit boring. That was just kind of like all of it combined into one. Um, well, maybe not boring, but there's just, it was just all of it combined into one. Yeah, Zetsubo was this weird, like, body horror, parasite thing, swamp. Yeah. Is that a bush cam on my top right? Yeah, sorry. I haven't shaved in a while. And I in chat wanted to see it, so, you know. Do I have a favorite wonder weapon out of all the games? Well, okay, so we know that the Sliquifier is the strongest wonder weapon out of all the games by far. It is the most busted, it is the most broken. We, we were aware of that of that fact. Um, Raygun Mark II is very good. It's dull. But it's very good. Paralyzer is the same. It's dull, but very good. I don't like... Oh, uh, okay. Okay. So, so, World of War, we had Raygun and the Wunderwaffe. The Wonder Waffle, as you called it. Um, neither of those. Black Ops 1, we had... The Frost Nova and the Thunder Gun. Thunder Gun was fun. Frost Nova was fun. Eh. Uh, Ascension had the Gersh device, doesn't count. Um, you had the Baby Maker. No, not that one either. What else? Um, you had the, the, the sniper rifle thing from, from what is it? Uh, the sniper rifle thing from Call of the Dead. Scavenger, thank you. Not good. Scavenger, blue, blue fat chunks. Not a fan of that scavenger. Um, what else? The VR-11, also not very good. Did not like the VR-11. And then you had... Uh, Baby Maker Shangri-La. And then... Okay, so Zap Gun's pretty up there. Zap Gun's pretty up there. Uh, I, I like Moon Zap Gun quite a bit oh okay if we had to do a if we had to do a tier list for one of the best reg guns though the icr probably is up there i would honestly argue the icr might be like a top three just gun in all of zombies this thing's headshot multiplier is fucking astonishing uh what else okay so so maybe zap gun in bo2 or BO1, sorry. If it weren't for you and Adeptus Ridiculous, I wouldn't have gotten into Warhammer. I'm building an orc army now. Nice! Good shit. We all we like some good orcs. Smork. Um, okay. Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2. We had Transit, which has the the jet gun, which is arguably the worst wonder weapon of all time. So we we, we get rid of that one. Um Sliquifier is the strongest wonder weapon of all time. But it's very boring and I don't like it, so we're not it's not up there. Uh what else? 
what else um paralyzer wasn't buried also very boring but very good mob ooh, mob of the dead has the blunder gat slash vitrolic witherer that's pretty up there the vitrolic uh uh or vitrionic witherer i forget how it goes that's pretty fucking up there that thing is great that thing is is great great uh yeah yeah of course i'm sorry Chet, you're right sorry the blunder get the trollic withering thank you withering the blunder get um what else do we have uh then we have all the staffs yeah we have the staffs staffs are good the staffs are up there man I, I actually, I actually really, really like the staffs. Um, for me, it's the frost staff. The frost staff for me is the big one. I like the frost staff. Yeah. Yeah, it's a basic take. I know, but it is good though. What else? And then what's that? Then we have BO3. So BO3, we have the Apothecary Servant, which is pretty up there. We have the bows from Darius and whatever, which is also very up there. Uh, then you've got, uh, what is it? Uh, Zetsubo, which is the, fuck, what's that gun called again, Zetsubo? The KT4, KT4? Right. Uh, and then you, uh, and then you have the, ooh, the Raygun Mark three, the Raygun Mark three in, in Gorod is pretty good. And then revelations is just all of them. Isn't it? I like the Mark three, actually the upgraded Mark three with the black hole. It's, it's fun. I like it. Oh shit. I might die here. And then BO four is just. I mean, I'll, I'll be totally honest. At that point, I've already, I, I've, I've lost, I've lost interest. I don't actually really remember those very well. So what is it? Zap. So for me, it's Zap Gun on Moon, Frost Staff, Apothecary Servant. I don't like. Okay, so the Apothecary Servant is like really good, but it's fucking. It's fucking boring, dude. It's really boring because it's it's too good. It's it's too strong. I'd probably go with the I, I you know what? I probably would go with like the frost staff it's just so good frost staff is fun it looks cool just the origin stabs in general pretty up there I, I yeah I like that I, I go with that frost staff is honestly the easiest one to me just the stabs and bows are cool Uh, no, Lightning Staff is not every robot. That's Wind Staff. Lightning Staff is uh, riding the train, or uh, riding the um, uh, the fucking um, the, the the tank. Ooh, oh right. Okay, the Wolf Bow, the Wolf Bow. I forgot about the Wolf Bow. That thing fucks. Honestly, chat, this 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 runs over at this point. 
Like, I'm just not gonna leave here. I'm too strong. Uh, yeah, this is every, every single one of these runs is this way. Yep. The, the, the fucking, the, the single railing. Here we are. Big hairy men. Oh, thanks. What? With a $5 big hairy men dono. Big hairy chatters right now. Seething. Have you gone airsoft and you ever considered it? I used to airsoft a lot back in the day. Uh, I really like airsofting. It is a ton of fun. I really don't like people who airsoft. That is my hang up. Yo, what's up, Linus Turd Tips? Thanks for joining the second channel YouTube memberships. So honestly, it's not even the, the military LARPers, you know? Like, they, I'm actually kind of okay with them because at least there's a point to it all. It's the, it's the fucking group of five dudes who do nothing but uh, play Airsoft to beat on other people who know, like, the refs because they go every single week and, and don't call their hits. And are just get really like fucking uppity and yell and, and get like just really anxiety annoyed, you know? The best airsoft games are like 20 people and they're all friends you know. They're all like close people. And it's at, you know, I was gonna say a private range, but you know, just like some some dude's five acre farm or backyard and then you put up some some crap everywhere and then you you call it there you know i i like airsofting it, it, it is fun it's also I mean, dude, it's a workout man you uh, you ever you ever airsoft and you you have to run past an area that you know people are looking at you from like you will sprint faster than you've ever sprinted in your life. It'll, it'll feel like it'll feel something. You'll, you'll feel it, but yeah, it's, uh, it, it does have a bit of a, a bit of a group. Hey, what's up, hockey? Thank you also for joining the memberships. I appreciate it. That's very nice of you. Yeah, uh, that's, uh, yeah, so a while, uh, one time, a long time ago, uh, we decided to airsoft at a, at a school, um, on a Saturday night. Um, this was, uh, like, before school shootings were becoming a bit more of a commonplace thing, so before Sandy Hook and stuff, um, was not the greatest at call, still, um, but, you know, did that and uh got the cops called on us that was interesting didn't didn't play at that school anymore what a time what a time but Oh, I like airsofting, but it's just not as, uh, ah, not as, not as much as used to. I don't, I don't do it like I used to back in the days. Also, that same person who said big hairy men said, I like when it's steamy and cloudy. What do you mean by that? Would you like to, would you like to explain yourself there? Maybe it's a tad bit more. Can I, can I get a bit of a, uh, you know, explanation? Um, yeah, yeah. Hmm, hmm, notes indeed. Hmm, notes indeed. See, there it is. There it, it hit. It landed. 
there it is mist weather is good mist weather is very man i love i love this map it's it's just it's such an interactive map you know chat it's so interactive there's just so much to do what a time hey brady cox thank you also for joining actual literal bricks what a what a map we're on right now we even have the the mob of the dead sound effects I'm so tired. Chat, what did you do to me? This was one of your faults. Oh, nachos. Popcorn or nachos? Nachos. Absolutely nachos. What do you what do you mean? I no one in chat would ever pick would it should ever ever pick popcorn. Why, why would you ever? No, it's apples. Chat, I swear to God, you. I swear to God. That was not in the cards. That was not part of the. That was not part of the statement. That was not an answer you could choose. Why can't I see this apple cat run? I'm so. Damn, I think I need a throat lozenge. I've been talking too much today. My throat's starting to hit me. All right, I'm going to get a throat lozenge. I'm not gonna lie to you, chat. I uh not gonna lie to you, chat. I, I didn't expect that the things that I would have here uh were gonna be just like Vix Vix vapor fucking lozenges. I of all you know, I thought it'd be like some kind of raspberry, whatever the hell it's called. And, and like they just smell like Vix. It's Vix tasting lozenges. Why? why? All right, you know what, chap? I'm fucking ending this match. You know, I, I don't know. I don't know why I keep playing this map. I know it's going to happen. I'm going to stay here the whole time and do absolutely nothing. Balaclava update. 
It did arrive. It did arrive. Shino Numa next? That's even worse. That's even more uninteractive. Well, we'll do the ball of clava another day. But we did we did get it. We did get it. Look at that. Look at that. Look at these. Look at that. 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 Beautiful. We, we need a more interactive map. We do have the ball clava though. All right. What's a good what's a what's a good interactive map? I mean, we can always do origins. That's that's a classic. Shadows ain't bad either. Um I mean Gorage is just amazing. It's such a good map. I'm doing it. We're gonna we're gonna have a hard time. We're gonna hurt ourselves. We're gonna enjoy it. Hell yeah. Oh, we go quick, 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 quick. We gotta move, 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 because this is recovery and so on. <laughs> Ace of Spades. We can't listen to Ace of Spades. Ding, 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 ding. Okay. Better find a way to reach Nikolai 1.0. He's oh, boy. One. Hey, Vault Dweller. Well, thanks for the resub. I, I appreciate you. Hi, Steve Blum. How you doing? All the smoke in the air has left me pretty thirsty. Damn it. Can I just get anything else that isn't this? Can I get anywhere from here or in plain sight? Thoughts on custom maps? Oh, they're fucking great. Custom maps are incredible. They, they, there's a, a consistent theme. The fact that the zombies community has done what it's done it, out of, in wake of no good zombies maps is just incredible best character from the crew i think i'm a nikolai fam but i blame this map this this map this map adds a lot to his character just in general oh so what it's so much apple cat run Why do I feel like why do I feel like the next the next highlight is gonna be called like like Bricky's caramel apple obsession or something? Or or the the the, the caramel apple files. And where's the piece? I've been watching you since the main war hammer Oh, thank you. Thank you very, very much. Was it Ian Garcia? Ooh, El Car, I shouldn't have bought that. There was the, no, it was right over there. Fuck. Um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm, I'm glad you enjoy the content and you enjoy the, uh, the, the big video. You know, that, that, that was a good time. Hey, you know, obviously we, we talked about it earlier in chat. It's fucking wild that video popped off the way it did, but it did. So, you know, we, uh, we move on with it. We keep it going. We keep it moving. But thank you for the super chat, yeah. It's always when the stakes are high that the Okay, there is like a constant fucking motion at front door shit right now, and I'm losing it. Oh, now I know why. <laughs> shit. Ammo runs low. What's my least liked map? Ooh, transit's pretty up there. Uh, transit's pretty fucking up there. Though after transit, I don't know. I really hate Shangri-La. I don't. I really dislike Shangri-La. It is just is not my vibe. I don't know what it is about that map. I don't know why I hate it so much. It's just it's so not for me. Okay, do we have? Oh, there we go. That's part one. Okay. What else? Why well, don't you like tra traversal? Oh, well, you see, I hate public transit because I'm an American. 
So, you know, naturally transit is awful. What do, what do they call? Okay, uh, chat. What is that that theme called again? Tr transit transit has a particular like art style. It's like Am Americana. Is that what it's called? Like old like fifties rural America America. Is it Amer Americana? Is that the name of it? Okay, I absolutely adore that that like style. It's just, it's just such a, it's such a fun style, you know. It's, it's just such a, a an enjoyable way to to make, uh, you know, like a, a kind of vibe. So, oh, it's transit. I was wondering where people were talking. Mariki was talking about trans people. All of a sudden, we spent the entire first like hour of the stream talking about trans people and how fucking good they are. At Guilty Gear Strive. Please get the wall shotgun on this map. It's a great pack a punch shoddy. What the K the the K K P M K B M whatever? Or do you mean the Argus? Because I'm kind of an Argus gang right myself. You know what? Actually, fuck you. I'm getting the Argus. I've chosen the Argus. Furries and trans people are good at fighting games. That was what I was saying earlier. I was saying me as a cis white male have a genetic disadvantage in fighting games. I, I did not choose this life. Like I, I finally have the ability to, to speak on my experience as a minority in a world. When I walk up into a smash tournament and immediately go 0 and 2. I can finally educate the masses. I have, I have no fucking chance, bro. None. The, the absolute, the absolute state of the FGC is just crushing. Listen, it'll, it'll be, it'll be quick. Once I, once I start my estrogen pills where I'm, I'm fucking, you're gonna have to watch out. Okay. You're gonna see me at Evo. You're gonna see me at Evo. And I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be looking fire. Oh, finally in plain sight. Skadoosh. Power restored. Systems operational. Access. Wait. Did someone just this this access? whole environment's great. Dude, Cold War Soviet era brutalism is also a great vibe. Oh, do not worry. He's right there. He is in the jar. He has been contained. Do not fear. I don't have Jug yet. I do want Jug, but I also kind of want to save up the money to just grab a Bowie knife and then farm points. Because we are doing pretty good. Uh oh, fuck yeah. Okay. There we go. Where's Bowie? That's Bowie. Fuck. I want to get the Bowie knife before, but it's all right. I'm gamer. Oh, that's gaming. That's fucking gaming. And we snagged enough for Jug. Hell yeah. Ooh, we gotta go, we gotta go down though. That's right, we gotta go down and around. Does B get any apples though? No, he can't handle it. He cannot handle the apples. Only I can handle the apples. Yeah, yes, there is a dragon protocol in this map. It is, uh... Listen, I'm a little scared. Because we got some furries up in here. Scalies up in here. So I'm a little frightened. But there are dragons, indeed. I don't understand this apple cat run thing. God damn it. Okay. Which one do I have? Coast Cylinder? Oh, fuck. Is that dragon control or is that... I think it has to be dragon control. Let him go. Yeah, dragging these nuts in your forehead. All right, where's my Groff module? Okay, left. Fuck, it's above. 
Oh, hell yeah, it's right here. This was the right call to get this fucking Bowie knife. This was the right call, I tell you. Yoink. All right, that's network circuit one. That was a huge shake. You know what, the Dango. Supply Depot code. Oh, fucking perfect, dude. We are actually gaming right now. What's up, Grim Canada? Well, I don't know what Canada did, but but you know what? It's as grim as you want to make it. Oh wait, wrong terminal. That's down there. Shit. Are you British? No. Why? What? Do I fucking sound British? First, how dare you? Wait, fuck, where's the module? Oh, it's that side. Listen, it's more about them just not understanding accents. Oh wait, it's in plain sight, not not anywhere over here. That's right. Evil Bricky be like, God save the queen. That's fucking funny. He's the opposite of British. He's Californian. No, 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 no. The opposite of British would be uh, being from Massachusetts. Be Bostonian. There are a few people who hate the British more than those from Boston. If it wasn't the massive amount of American history that was present there, it's the uh, massive Irish uh, com um, community. They are. Yeah, I think Dead Ended is an underrated one of the uh, of the Black Ops Three group. Black Ops 3 has some bangers, though. Oh, come on. No, no, no. All three network circuits. Drop that. Network's in. Okay, sick. Uh, we need other. Uh, we 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 need we need shield. We need dragon shield. We need to find the last part for it. Probably up here somewhere. I think I know where the last part is. Any, uh, in plain sight is so good. It's so good. It's so good. Okay. Where are we heading to? Um, we're up top. Uh, we're already on level on, on round eight. Fuck, dude. Okay. Shit. I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to remember 
dragon shield face spawns it should be somewhere around here right or am i in the wrong spot this should be dragon face right or is this or is dragon face over oh we're opening the map up because that's fine oh shit christ Well, uh, hey. Crap. The dragon, is the dragon's head not here? Is the head the side bit? Is it the infirmary? It's on the, oh, shit. Yeah, I don't know the sound design being that good either. That was actually really impressive. For the forehead and the emperor. Why, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the two dollars. Wait, probably above. Head is really here? Oh, fuck, there it is. You're right. Holy shit. It's the, it's the, it's the, the brain thing. That's okay. Okay. Okay, that's good. Good seeing you at Paxway. Ah, oh, thanks, thanks. Yeah, no, it was it was a great time. I hope you made it home safe as well. Always fun, dead, always fun seeing everyone at Pax. Fucking dragon. fucking dragon. Oh, oh, dude, Dark Crow solo Easter egg is is a is a massive pain. I that's one of those ones that I just I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm doing that. You know. Kind of want Widow's Wine. <sighs> kind of don't think I will, though. I think I, I think I might need a uh, uh, Speed Cola. I guess I guess if I get the right guns, I don't need Speed Cola. Fuck, that's right, the drones. God, I forgot about the drones. Uh, turns out the dingo actually kind of takes him down pretty hard. Uh. All right, that wasn't too terrible. Dingo would be amazing with speed cola, but I, I, th I think I think this might be a. Uh, but but we could do widows instead. But if, if we did Widows, we would need something like the Draken. Something that just, that just puts out insane DPS with not too terrible of a uh, reload speed. That is not what we want. That is <laughs> quite the opposite. What we got? Work better if I mm. chew faster. Always done swiftly is fine. Okay, we can utilize insta kill here. <laughs> I mean, I like the BRM better than the dingo, but not necessarily what I was hoping for. Oh, man of war, let's go. I can I can roll. I can roll man of war. I can roll man of war with brl but no i can't roll brm though brm is still it's still too much of a reload i do want widow's wine do i like the ray gun the ray gun's good you 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 eventually th there's like there's like a like a soy jack bell curve that goes along with the ray gun um and this the soy jack bell curve generally states like, oh, the ray gun is the best thing ever. Pack a punch, whatever. And then you have the 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 screaming soy jack in the middle that goes, no, the ray gun doesn't generate you enough points. And then 
do you have the, the hooded one is like the ray gun is, is really really good the ray gun is really really good the aoe is great and if, if you're good at the game you don't have to worry about actually blowing yourself up with it heel kick is not is not the play My favorite weapon? Well, we had to talk about the wonder weapons earlier, but if we had to do, do like a, a favorite base stat line gun for zombies. Brother. Okay. Um, I mean, the ICR is up there. I won't lie though. The BRM kind of is, is pretty up there. The BRM slaps. The BRM fucking rips. It, it's much very similar to the ICR where it has a massive headshot multiplier uh so it actually just tends to get not only more points but kill faster you know just better DPS in general um the Draken is I'd argue probably the most overpowered weapon in all of uh in all of zombies Can't have too much of a good thing. <sighs> it's it has massive penetration high ammo capacity um quick reload speed it's just it's it's so good it's a speed cola you know we made our choice we, we made our fucking choice Yeah, the Draken. D R A K O N. Yeah, that Draken. It's very, very, very good. Oh, man. Man of War is also really, really good. I love the Man of War. It's also a top five. I, I'd say ICR, Draken, BRM. Uh, what else? In, what else in BO3? Ooh, what else in BO3 actually? Like genuinely though. Oh, the Brecky. Yeah, the Bre the Brecky. The, the the 205 Brecky. Yep, yep. That's also up there. HVK is not bad. Uh lacks ammo. HVK burns through ammo a bit quickly. But its fire rate is pretty solid, which is why why it burns through ammo a bit quickly. Dude, the Brecky in multiplayer was fucking ridiculous. Hey, Brecky, I've never played Mass Effect before. Which games can I romance the girl in the hazmat suit? Okay, that'd be Tally. And um, you can't in game one, but you can in game two and game three. So I'd recommend romancing nobody in game one and then romancing her in game two and three. Uh, but, uh, but yeah. Please give the KSG shotgun a chance. I have used the KSG shotgun many a times in this game. It is perfectly fine, but high damage is not a, uh, is not a highly sought after trait in zombies. You want good fire rate, you want ammo capacity, and you want headshot multiplier. No reason to conserve ammo now. All right, let's get. Let's go. This map is so stupid. I love it. Ancient Spain, thanks for the 31 months. Welcome back. Yeah, th th this map is literally fuck it. We're gonna put a dragon this in this map. Why? Cause fuck you. 
Such a good map. You know, with two pack of punch weapons, this might be this might be a uh, lockdown time. Hopefully, I don't have to use this to keep Nikolai in check. Lockdown. That's right, we got manglers. Okay, I'm going down. Oh God. Oh shit. Oh, I didn't even notice they all arrived through there. Ah, oh, damn. Sick. Is that that epic gamer Bricky? I mean, with the name Slimy Keck, perhaps. Fuck yeah! All right, we got the we got the the buff at the tombstone in the beginning. See. You see, chat, this is, this is why, as fun as the OG zombies experiences are, uh, maps like Krovi and, and, and whatever, I, I can't pronounce it, the Russian for it, but these kinds of maps are, to me, the best because they provide such a large amount of, um, of things to do. The other maps get boring and a bit simplified. And like, that's fine for some folks, but for me, you know, I, we just saw it with, with Derisa. You just, you just get, you know, you, you go to the catwalk and you're done. Kino, you, you train around the stage and you're done. But these maps offer such a large amount of, uh, of gameplay choices. Things to earn, objects to go for. Like what I'm doing right now. Right now I'm literally I'm literally doing this long multi-wave holdout so that I can get a dragon airstrike. And that's just that's just fucking cool, you know? Like how can you consider that anything but dope as shit? Plus, uh, you know, this map, uh, what is it? The, this map, uh, the, the Easter egg of this map is a, a drunk Russian Nikolai fucking piloting a combat mech, teaming up with you to fight a dragon while the, the Soviet national anthem blares in the background. It is the greatest uh, example of who gives a shit. It's amazing. Fuck you. Unfortunately, this map's Easter egg is a massive pain in the ass to deal with. Which is a good reason why I'm not going to be doing it. If I understand the map slash lore correctly, we are playing time slash dimension traveling zombie killers trying to find their earlier selves in another dimension in a race against time against gods and Lovecraftian entities. There is also dragons and zombie infested Stalgram where the Soviets have mechs. That is correct. Currently, we are attempting to find our older selves in a parallel dimension to siphon their blood into a summoning stone to stop a dimensional uh, gods from taking over the universe. In the first game, the zombies uh, were a Nazi experiment because the Nazis were evil. Time something went our way. 
Things have changed. This ship always loses its taste too damn fast. What's this? A dragon egg? I can teach it a thing or two about a badass. What's gonna Okay, I'm trying to remember the steps to get the gauntlet of Siegfried. Uh, do we need to place the egg for the dragon to, to burn? Is that the next step? Okay. Wait, I think I can actually... I think I can actually, um... Blast it with the with the the airstrike, can't I? Maybe we should try and break the news to him. Oh, one last thing. Do you have any vodka? They appear to be running very low. Oh no, no, chat! It's almost round fifteen, which means we need to listen to Doctor Monty. Literally the worst part of all zombies. work based on my inability to pick the egg up I think it works oh okay I guess thanks brother thought that was lights out Well, that sucked. That I act I, that was actually kind of shocking. I got immediately pummeled. And I only have enough money for a regular jug. That's not good. That was that this is very suboptimal. And this is black. This is this is Gora. This this is not an easy map. It's actually a really hard map. I I I probably put this harder than Zetsubo. Zetsubo is a knowledge thing. I mean, this is also kind of a knowledge thing, but. Well, that was pretty damn refreshing. Okay. What is it? Bathe the dragon egg in fire. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Yeah, Zetsubo does have better training spots, that's true. Gonna keep walking while I chew this. I have been watching. No, it's Monty! Oh, I just he just, he just Good, get, because he fucking is. I feel okay, that was very strange. It cut him off. Um, but I will say, I find I find the possibility of just doing the Willem Dafoe looking up meme for the Dr. Monty to be pretty solid. That is how I would use this. Okay. Speakola is in depot, if I'm not mistaken. By, yeah, okay. Do we bathe it? Dragon must cool. Okay, cool. So we did we did bathe it. Let's go. Oh boy. Yeah, there are really not that many. There are really not that many train spots in this map, is there? Good God. Yoink. All right, you know I just want the round them to be and to be done with. The entirety of the universe is fractured. Yes, egg. Broken. Okay, we got egg back. Why? Why? Why is Monty overlapping on himself? Fix it. 
Something's up with plutonium. Or no, it's not plutonium, it's boy. Alright. I do not remember what the next step is. I think it it might be it might be kill enemies with with shots combined. Kill napalm zombies. Right. Right, because the the steps for this thing are annoying. So we got to set them on fire first. Which requires us to train the dragon up here. And then we have to kill them. So it means we need to train probably up here for a bit. Until the dragon decides to arrive. That's a lot. That's a lot, a lot. Okay. That's a bit, uh, that's, oh, it's a bit tight. That's a bit. Mm. We're okay. That was that was a fucking Monka moment. Okay, I think, okay, I think I got them. Okay, I don't have all of them. I'm a little too fast. Luckily, I don't need to kill that many zombies. Dragon! Dragon! Hello? Willem Dafoe looking up meme. Hello? Imagine dragons, canon in League of Legends. Yeah, baby gap for the Rizzler. Let's go, chat. All right. So, now that that's done. Oh. Okay. Always on swiftly. God damn it. Okay. Get penetrating multi kills. Fuck. This is the one I don't like. Because we need to. We don't. We need like a dragon. We, uh, we we might need to go hit the box. Fuck, that's my shield. I need that. Oh my god! Does the mounted gun work? I don't know, but I don't know if I can line them up for that. Good question. I'm not quite sure. Okay, I'm gonna get a new, gonna get a new shield. All right, undead, we're gonna hit the box. Go get him, fire that would work. work the Argus would work there we go this would just say come no they said gawk the fuck is gawk bloodberry what does that mean
it's, it's G O C K, like Glock. All right, I don't know. Ch chat's on something. Melee kills. Let's go. We are gonna need to pap this though. I hear a mangler. Okay, so... One, okay, so I'm going to need to... I'm going to need a new gun. We got the Argus done with, but we, we're going we're gonna to need another gun because the Argus is not going to carry us through this time frame. Oh, thank God. It's actually a good time for the Valkyries. I would never... I would normally never say that. God fucking damn it, of course. Okay. Oh, it spawns the zombies. That's right. They start electrifying and making zombies. Thanks, Steve Blum. Where is the box? Where is the box? Where is the box? There's the box. It might be underneath. Or oh, no, it might be above. Ah, it's above. Okay. Back where I got my Argus. This is fucking terrible, but you know, we'll we'll grab it to speed things up. This like doesn't suck. This does suck. This is really bad. I think I'm already developing Aim right. This is great. Excuse you. Hello? Any chatters? Bro. There. Who is who is this fucking asshole spawning them? <laughs> Fuck that guy. <laughs> he just this kept sending them. Okay, I'm gonna need to pack a punch the brekkie, but this is a good gun. We can run with this. Still need melee kills, okay. After the melee kills, I believe we will incubate the the um the egg, and then we need to survive the incubation on the bottom, which uh is gonna be a little a little tough. I'm not gonna lie. Ow. Oh bro. Oh bro. I think we got it. I would like to double check though. Yes, incubation time. Okay. And we have, or we will soon, have just enough to ride the dragon. Wait, which cylinder do I, I think I have the dragon terminal cylinder again. Ow. 
Then we need to serve. Okay, can we do? Can we get in plain sight while we're here? That would be so pog. That's not pog. It's quite the opposite of pog, in fact. So I can still kind of do the slide cancel. I'm not as good at it. Oh. All right. Okay. Okay. We're doing all right. We're doing okay. After we have the Gauntlet of Siegfried, there's not much past that. I mean, I guess we could keep trying to do the, the Easter egg, I suppose, but... Or I guess we could do the uh, the Angel Wings, but that's kind of part of the Easter egg, I think. Incubation. Alright. This part here is a, honestly a run killer. I'm glad we actually got the shotgun. This is absolutely a fucking run killer right here. Is that all? Oh, sick. Okay. Dragon Egg much cool. So I think I think we're good. I think I need to leave and come back next round. You know, if we're here. Time for the time for the thing. First step, second step, third step. Oh yeah, scroll, scroll. Siegfried Gauntlet. Get the gauntlet, right? Incubate the egg. Go back, finish the round, get the egg. Dragon Strike controller, got that already. Upgrade the Dragon Strike. It's the flags. That's right. Okay. Well, I need to kill 40 zombies with the dragon strike first. Okay. Literally. 40, 40 uh, kills with the dragon strike is part one. Forgot how long these are. Hey, listen, once I get the gauntlet, there's not much left to do in this map. So we might as well get the gauntlet and like, you know, do the Easter egg. If we're going to, I mean, the, the, the gauntlet, I will, we'll try to. I will most likely die doing so. I'm glad I didn't actually, actually spend that. It should go to zero after. There we go. Come on, in plain sight, in plain sight, in plain sight, in plain sight. Let's go. All right. So now we need to go get the gauntlet back. We should be good now. Hey. I think you do need the Dragon Strike uh, upgrade to do it. Oh, 
Oh, maybe you don't. Actually, you might not to. Might not need to. All right. First step, you must collect six trophies around the map. One trophy in the sculpture of the building in front of power at Dragon Command. It will then fall and you can pick it up. All right, so we got to do, we got to get the trophies. I mean, the Gauntlet of Siegfried is really fucking good. So, like, it's, it's still just a good thing to have with us. But. Oh. All I don't know what that one was, but that was something important, clearly. That normally is good. It normally means I did, like, a challenge of some kind. Okay, so it looks like we need to survive a whole round. So we might need to just be here for a little bit longer. Okay, wait, hold on. Are there any trophies down here that I should probably get? Oh, shit, yeah. Top of the tunnel when you are ejected. Operation Bunker. Okay. It's... No, it's just... Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. It's just in the water. There's nothing down here in the bunker. Hey, Captain Sad. Thanks for the, uh... The Captain Sad. What the hell? Thanks for the Prime Sub. Okay. Red. Red item. Got it. Accessible in the toilets back to the Pack-a-Punch building. Okay. Oh boy. I guess that's where Nikolai got a smell from. Nice. There it is. Literal dragon, actual dragon, literally actually a dragon, flamethrower dragon, it's actually a dragon. It can also fly away and I can punch everything to death. Greatest goddamn fucking game ever made. Goddamn literal tiny dragon turret running around. Fire fucking dragon, punch, throw dragon, punch away, bring back dragon, burn shit. Greatest goddamn video game ever made, I tell you what. Hell yeah. Okay, so we need to start getting the rest of the trophies. There's probably one in here. So trophies first. There it is. Looking for trouble. Sure found it. That's one trophy. Oh fuck, that's my Thank God for that. It's gobble gum is so busted. Okay, that was one that was one trophy. Um, what else do we have? Operation bunker. Smash the safe with the gauntlet of Siegfried. Top part. Gotcha. Okay. And then supply depot hole with water. Business on the back, party in the front. That's brain junkie! These are things I should have gotten earlier. Oh, I need to use Dragon Strike on it. Come on, Dragon. I like it well done. There we go. Trophy two. They need to activate the big laser inside here, too. Like ants in a magnifying glass. 
why that affects that thing i have no idea but i don't care God damn, this thing goes for a while. That is uh, one, way too dank. And two, uh, definitely the sound that you get when you get enough stuff with the Dragon Strike controller. Okay. That is two. Step two, Ascend from Darkness. Step three, Rain Hell. A fire, shit. Step five, Skewer the Winged Beast. Step six, wield a fist of iron. Step seven, raise hell. Step eight, free them. What a time. Good times, man. Tank factory, Fafnir trophy, fire. I can't see. Black Ops 1, good, great game. Black Ops 1, excellent game. Great stuff. Yeah, I should have been doing these things all the, at the other, uh, during the rest of the map, but I was too busy wanting to get the gauntlet. Okay, so where is this again? I hate these things. Hold on, did I do that right? Oh, right. It's on the inside. It lands in here, right? Oh, boy. Okay. All good. Uh, let's see. Um, Big fan, Bricky. Warm is the heart. Know you love zombies, too. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Zombies is, is one of my favorite pastimes by far. Okay, so we got that. Is that all of them? Do we, no, we need to go back into the uh, into the toilet. Hell yeah. Yeah, we, we gotta go back to the toilet, and then we gotta get the trophy from the toilet. We're also gonna need new gobble gum. Might be crawler time. Oh, wait, sorry, we also need to do the Gauntlet of Siegfried one. Get me out of here! Right, because we need to punch the safe down below as well. Yeah, well, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop these both the next time. Also, Ian Garcia, thanks for the donations, though, very, very much. That's very nice of you. Appreciate it. Okay, so we got these two. So now the toilet down below. Where's the toilet? I forget where the toilet is. Opposite side of Pap, thank you. Corn Thief, you have clearly played a lot of zombies. Aha! Can I activate the fucking generator down here now that we have the... Oh shit! It's already, we already got it, let's go! Okay. Probably didn't need to activate the generator that early, if I'm being honest, but it's okay. Now we use Gauntlet Siegfried on the uh, command terminal area in the bottom. That was good. That was good, Steve Blum. That was uh, sounded like you actually were really fucking upset. 
All right. Uh, safe. Here we are. There we go. Oh shit! I, it's still going anyway. Oh whatever. Okay, that should be all. That, that that should be all. That should be all the trophies. Third step. Uh, do, there are six valves on the map. They have a display with a white with an arrow where you can select one, two, or three. The valves also have a light that can be blue, green, or white. Okay. Okay. Oh god, six. There's so many valves. Examine the valves inside one of them. You should see a code cylinder stuck. On another valve, there'll be a green light. This is the end of the circuit. The other valves will be lighted white, meaning they are not receiving air or blue, meaning they do receive air from their valve. The goal is to connect all the valves. <sighs> I forgot that this is what zombies was like. There was diagrams and everything. Um... Jeez, oh god, shit, fucking hell. That's right, this is what zombies was, this is what we did! Oh uh, yeah, okay. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Um... Oh shit. Wait, was the website you were referring to Corn Thief? Uh Cranorium? Cause this is uh, yep, okay. I just saw this. Yep. Alright, I perfect. So uh alright, we need to find the green and we need to find the pink. We'll do uh we'll do Dragon Command first. It's because it's the most obvious. Where was the valve again? Was it, uh... Nope, that's that you would think, but no. Fuck. Damn it. Alright, where the hell is that valve? Down below? Was it above? Oh, there it is. Uh, neither. Okay. So it's not in Dragon Command. We'll try the three down below. Actually, it's not really three down below. It's, it's two. It's one above, one below. Okay. The valve is up here, isn't it? Fuck. As I have I have not done this in so long. Oh. Blue light. Okay, we don't want blue light. We want we want green light. Ooh. I'm assuming it's above here. I'm assuming it's in here, maybe. That was gobble gum. Wait, tank factory. It says it's in the corner. Is it like up here? It's under? Fuck. like under under like mega under aha neither god damn it all right it's fine it's fine uh man oh the zombies experience training a zombie for like a hour and a half and then doing everything else okay so all right we don't want to go up that way we'll go around 
Okay, so, so far we haven't found the green nor the pink, but we only have a couple more options. So, here, valve is, this one should be maybe a bit easier to find, or I'm just stupid. Aha, blue again, K, is it actually the last two? Is it actually supply depot and department store? No fucking way, no shit. No shot. No, no, none. <sighs> okay. There it is. There's green, you bitch. All right. Green is... Supply Depot is green. Which means it's department. St oh, okay, I'm gonna double check to make sure it's department stores in case it didn't just gla uh, glaze over it before. But we're gonna go to the department store. Oh wait. Oh my god. I'm, I'm I'm so upset. They literally have, they literally have where they are top floor next to staircase, listed on this website. There it is. It was the last two. Department store. All right. Fuckers. Absolute shit lords. I can't believe it. All right. So supply depot on that one, which means, all right, if we're heading here to this, what was what this? This is, uh, what, what, what is this one? This is armory, right? Yeah. Armory needs to go to two. Okay. Armory is at two. And then infirmary needs to go to three. Dragon command to Okay. Dragon command two now. Oh, I guess we can't do this one yet. Tank station needs to go to one. Yeah, that probably makes sense. Where my baby dragon go? Uh, it, it regenerates HP. It, it's back in my hands, so to speak. Take command's already at one. Thor's tank station's already at one. Wait. Are we done? Do we do we maybe already Was that were the others already set correctly perchance? I don't hear any more hissing. Oh, the generator is off. That's fucking right. I forgot we have to turn the gen back on. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Girl, Crovey is a great map. The map, the map is amazing. There's nothing wrong with the map. It's the, the Easter egg is a bit rough. Don't worry about it. Fine. It, it should hold on to our prior choices. Yeah, I suck nothing compared to this. Ugh. Okay, what is after this?
Sophia. Sophia's after this. Wait, why am I here again? Generator. Wait, it's still on. Is it not? Trim your bush. Oh, wait, I have to... Trim my bush? You know what? That's it. You're gonna, you're, gonna, you're gonna talk about my bush that way? You don't get plant cam anymore. You get no plant cam. I have rescinded it from you. Right, you can only turn the generator on every round, so I gotta I got turn it back on, I believe. There we go. Hey, that Brooklyn guy. Thank you for the tier one sub. What are your thoughts on BO4 and why was Blackout the superior battle royale? You know, Blackout probably was the superior battle royale. I actually think of my. Um, ah, maybe. Maybe. Warzone had moments of it being very, very, very good. Jesus Christ, Steve Blum. Um, okay. So tank, tank factory. There we go. Needs to go to two. What was the other one I was missing? Was it Dragon Command? No, it takes us just to go to one. Shit. How dare you take away my constitutional right to plant cam? God damn it! I accept my fate. I accept it. The run wasn't technically over, but but my 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 will was over. My will had ended. That's just the way that's just the way it goes. That's just the way it goes. All right. Chat. I'm definitely not going to DoorDash a few caramel apples tonight. There's no reason to do that. That is a stupid idea, and I will absolutely not even consider it. Thank you all very much for watching the stream. I appreciate it. Let's go ahead and raid someone, yeah? Let's se let's send you all off to, uh, oops. Let's send you all off to some, the, the, the big time. Hey, look, you got Blank Cam back. Aren't you happy? We're, 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 we're on, we're on the world. We're on the way. All right. All right. You know who we're rating. All right. You're prepped, chat. Prepared. You ready? You stoked? You excited? All the good stuff. Say hi. Say all the good stuff. Uh, I will see you tomorrow for more stream. All right? All right. Peace out, chat. Have a good one. Don't pee your pants. <laughs>